full on gremlin mode today, by the way. I'm so tired. Hi, George. How you doing? Hi, Kelly. Hi, Pink. Hi, Gigi. I know Gigi's here. Also, Catherine dropped a resub and then ran. So, shall I replay that? Hold on. I need to bring the. Because I don't have the thing anymore. Let me drop this. Hold on. Hey. Oh, thank you for watching the YouTubes, Catherine. Thank you. Thank you for the resub as oh wow well, you didn't run you were still here <laughs> she'd run away she disappeared thank you for that how many months is that 25 25 that is a lot of months catherine that is so many months it's just it blows my mind thank you so much i super duper 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 appreciate it thank you and also thank you for the youtube stuffs i really 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 appreciate that as well mm. I was editing another one for this morning. There's one there's one scheduled to go out later today and then that's it again. They're all caught up with me. So uh, I have to do some more editing later. Mm -hmm. Hi, Latical. Hello. Have I seen the update? No. Yes and no. We raided into UK Simmer yesterday, um, Lisa, and she was playing it. So I saw a little bit, but I was like in and out and I had to go and get my kids from school and whatever. I haven't played it myself yet. I haven't even opened my game yet. So it's gonna be basically all new when i open my eyes and i see it um i've been trying to avoid spoilers because I, I like to react to it like first time so it's great you should watch um the youtube from tuesday later yay that's so cool thank you simon hi welcome in um you went on it yesterday feeling ill just to check donald's shop you. merlin merlin what was that merlin five gifties thank you so much for the five what the heck zana got one oh how about that and rachel and soph and toe mom and lewis wow you know you can just come in and say hello right man and you don't have to come in and drop five gifts of every single time but i do appreciate it <laughs> thank you so very much thank you <clears throat> sarah a long time no see how you been You've been to Scrooge's shop. I missed your first part of your message. Hold on, what did you say? What did you say? Um, you went on it yesterday. You were feeling ill to check Donald's shop and you played for six hours straight. <laughs> Artie's hello. How are you doing? Oh, Artie. Is that Artie, like, SA? Have you changed your name? Or is that a different Artie? That is going to be so happy. She will be. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Merlin. Hi. You've changed your name. I thought, I was like, is it? Is it the same Artie? But it is, so that's fine. How are you doing, my love? Let me put one in for Catherine, first of all, because I didn't do that yet. And then let's do five for the gift subs that Merlin has so generously donated to the community. So we've got one for Zana, one for Soph, wasn't it? One for Toe Mom, one for Lewis. And I've forgotten who the fifth one was for. I just read it out and I've already forgotten. But thank you very much. You've been lurking here and there. You've been, as it's been rough. I get that. Absolutely understand that, but I, um, um, yeah, I did, yeah, I did one for you. I mean, the fifth gift sub. Who was it for? Rachel. It was for Rachel. I read them out. I was like, there was Zanna and Soph and Tom Mom and Lewis. And there was someone else as well. It was Rachel. Rachel Cave. Yeah, I did that one for you. You dreamt about one of the cute cosmetics. <laughs> did you really? Hey, Desi. Hi. Uh, I'm glad that you're here. And I'm glad that you're, um, you're doing okay, though, Sarah. It's so good to see you. It's good. It's, it's been lovely to have you here lurking all this time uh like i was i was telling i was telling my husband and my kids yesterday i was like M people have been saying really nice things about me recently and i don't know what to do <laughs> i'm not used to getting nice compliments things and stuff but it's been really really nice so uh don't stop um laggy on both switches so um we'll play more dvd on your oh, okay, okay, okay okay yes i said dvd then didn't i it's ddv disney dreamlight valley not dvd no, that's something very different. Um, did you get your Switch update at the same time as your Steam update? Because I know that sometimes the Switch one rolls out a little bit later. But mine came out at the same time. Like, while we were watching Lisa after we raided, I forced closed down Steam and reopened it, and it automatically downloaded, like, there and then at, like, 2, 5 past 2, whatever it was. It came five minutes later. Oh, that's really good, though. That's really good. Like, they say in the Discord to allow, like, two hours. So five minutes is good. Yours was later when you came on at four. Oh, that's fine. Hey, Tessa, hello. Why is it that compliments are so much harder to take than criticism? That's something that I'm going to take up with my therapist when I speak to them. <laughs> but yeah, yep. 
they don't they stick a little bit um easier don't they criticisms you're more likely to believe them than when someone says something nice i think it's uh i think it's a a childhood thing <laughs> but we're not gonna get into that right now um tiny little bit of lag on your pc but it's the dinosaur so it might be oh on your because i haven't dropped any frames i think my bitrate's been okay but hey bailey how you doing darling um you're in discord and the switch users got the update before you oh really why do you not think about them for days and weeks after it's the same way as insults i know right someone says something nasty about you and like that sticks and it sticks with you for a long time a long time but someone says something nice and the first thing you do is dismiss it and then you never think about it again oh not the game the stream oh i see i see i see, I see. um the game not the stream i see that's fine you were playing this earlier, you'd have all loved so much. Yeah, I'm excited, I'm excited. I was just saying, Bailey, I haven't even opened the game yet. I updated it and I haven't touched it. I've been really good, I deserve a medal. Because up until now, before, when we've had updates in the past, I have played it. I have, I played it off stream and I was like, screw you guys, I'm gonna play it. But <laughs> this time I was like, nah, I'll save it. It's only a day in it, I'll save it. So I've been very, very good and I deserve a medal. Um. You went out yesterday, so you had to update your Switch when you got home. Does it not automatically do it? I can't remember how Switch's update. You have to turn it on, don't you? Um, they've updated. Yes, I saw that. Have th they fixed that now, didn't they? Because that was meant to be in the update, that the blue chests give you 50 Moonstones instead of 10 a day. But it hadn't rolled out with the update, but they've sent out a little hot fix for it. So that should be fixed now. You got 50 yesterday? Yeah. I don't know what time it said in the Discord that they'd fixed it. Uh, it should have been sent through to my own Discord, actually, in my Disney Journal Valley channel. If I can find it. Uh, yeah, yesterday at half past 9pm for me, um, it, they said that they'd fixed it, so that was pretty good. You already finished the Star Path? Already? Oh, heck, I mean, I know I'm normally quite fast on the Star Paths, but already? Down. <laughs> also i would like to get some vindication for the fact that i was i told everybody that there was going to be microtransactions and several people not you lot but several people on the internet in other streams and on twitter shouted me down and told me no they won't the developers said that there wouldn't be microtransactions i'm like it's a free-to-play game there's going to be microtransactions there's going to be it's game loft i've played games by game loft before i know how it works and like, no, no, there's not going to be any. I'm like, okay, if you don't, if you say so. And then what did we get in the update yesterday? Microtransactions. Just, I'm going to be smug for a little bit. Yeah, you knew exactly, Bailey. It's a free game. It's a free game with no ads because it's on PC as well as and Switch. It's not a mobile game, you know? Yeah, anybody who believed that there wouldn't be microtransactions is a twit. Mm-hmm bigger streamers as well i'm sorry to say like no they def they said that there wouldn't be micro transactions like okay okay do you will i'll serve you with a slice of humble pie today i'm not gonna be buying them now mm -mm -mm. do you time skip as one quest takes five days in the star path that's a good yeah that's a good point joe do you have you been time skipping because they say not to do that because it can break how would they make money exactly exactly i mean this is early access so i'm i'm surprised that they've added in the microtransactions this early like i would have thought that they would have waited yeah like sarah like i would have thought that they would have saved the the microtransactions until the game was actually free to play because at the moment if you want it you still gotta buy it hey jixies hello i'm good thank you because i was saying earlier i'm just in full gremlin mode today i'm tired and I'm feeling a bit ill. I've got the uh, beginnings of a cold starting, so we're gonna just... Uh... You've been doing um, some time skipping. Has it not been breaking your game though? Hi Ninja, hello. Um, we'll get in and we'll have a look at what the, um, what the things are. I think I would like my house to look like the palace, the, the big castle thing. I think I would like that. I'm, I'm pretty sure I've got enough moonstones for it. I don't remember. 
you got it on Game Pass, so it's practically free. I was lucky enough to be give, gifted it from the developers for free, so I didn't pay anything. Um, so yeah, that's good. And I got like the ultimate edition as well, so I got all of the extra bits. You know, like hey, there were three different levels that you could buy. There was like the twenty-five pound one, like the fifty pound one, and like the sixty pound one or whatever. Um, I got the sixty pound version, but I got it for free. Um, you won't be doing it just in just in case. Yeah, it's not like with Animal Crossing where you can time skip and stuff and it's fine. Um, the people who make Disney Donut Valley did say specifically, don't time skip because it's going to break your game. Never again. <laughs> right, Catherine. Oh, dear me. <laughs> if it's not the consequences of my actions. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's fine it's fine need to do more pumpkins and get some more money <laughs> who would do such a thing Catherine? i don't know i i kind of quit playing disney juno valley honestly um i was doing the whole pumpkin grind and i just got bored of it it was just boring to me <laughs> Oh dear. My son's at home today, so I have to be on my best behavior today. He's, his teachers never seem to want to work a Friday before they have a week off school, like for a half term break, so he's here today. My son, my daughter's at school, but my son's at home. <laughs> so I gotta be a good girl today. No swearing. He's playing Red, are you playing Red Dead? Playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, you got bored just as you hit Stitches level 10 quest. I still haven't finished Stitches quests. I still have quests for Stitch to do. So at least I've got something in the game to do. If like we hit a roadblock with the new ones, um, then I haven't like, you know, sometimes I haven't played the quest, so I don't know what's there, but sometimes they're ones where you have to wait a little while. If we hit a roadblock with them, then I can go back and do some of the ones from previous before the update because they're still there. You're at level 7 with the new characters. Ooh, already? Damn. I like the idea that you can change their profession. Can you only change it once they get to level 10 though? You can't change it on like a lower down one. Um, you have this app on PC called Wiimod. Um, so you use that so the energy doesn't deplete. And you can do money and stuff. All right. Witch, hi. How are you doing? Some good vibes in your life? Aww. I was just saying that everyone was being really nice to me yesterday and I'm not used to it, but welcome back in. Come back and say nice things. It's nice. <laughs> you haven't tried to change it yet. Um, you think you're going to give it a go? Yeah, I'm, I love that. I, I'm happy that they've brought that in. And I'm happy that there's a new, there's new chest things, apparently, and that you can have um sign posts like in stardew valley rather than having to do the thing that we were doing with the table behind the chest and putting the thing on the table i like the idea of there being a, a, a sign post now that sounds good and um there was a whole i read the blog post yesterday didn't i on stream i read it to see what was going to be in it You like the tables more to be honest i mean you can still continue to use the tables if you prefer them i might end up preferring the tables after seeing the the sign posts i just like the idea that there's the option now and i like that you can move the doors and i like that you can um update the outside of your house and stuff um your friends ranted about Juno valley really are they not happy with it Looking forward to streams. You're feeling a bit lost. Oh, oh, Pink. I'm happy that I'm here to help you and give you something to, to take your mind off of stuff and stuff, you know? You accidentally made my wand of the wrong thing. You wanted to fish, but you clicked the button by mistake. So you're happy you can make it change? Exactly, exactly. I made, um, I think I made Mickey a forager when I think I would have preferred him to be a gardener. I can't remember which way around I did it. Tessa! Fan. That's illegal. That's illegal. You're not allowed to say those nice things. <laughs> Mickey Mini a gardener's for you. I know Mini definitely is a gardener for me. Definitely. I might make Maui something else because I made Maui a digger. 
and he's in the way because we all know how big of a character Maui is and then you're trying to dig and he's just there like Anya all the time so then you have to like build a little corral to keep him in and it's just too much hassle like you know who's a good digging character um uh Remy because he's tiny <laughs> you made him a miner do not take him into the mines with you though oh can you imagine because they're quite narrow corridors aren't they and he's just there like you can't get past him buzz yeah buzz or woody the tiny characters yeah i think who did i make buzz a gardener i might have done because him being so small or a digger you know when you have to like be there miners i have uh who's a miner for me with an e not an o by the way um scrooge i think and to be free and like fixed up um you feel like they lied and are dragging their feet with it which is valid at least he thinks because it's how she feels you know i haven't spent much money disney's meh on your list but you love hearing about the game yeah so it's still early access right so there's gonna be updates but they're gonna be slower i feel like if you waited and waited until it came out free to play all of this stuff that we're getting like drip fed would be in the game from the start so there would be more content it does feel like it's a bit dragging their feet to us because we're right there at the very beginning with it like we i don't know it's it's all going to be there they're adding stuff for later this year yeah i did i did they've got lots planned haven't they it's gonna add like multiplayer and stuff as well potentially in the future love Remy. i like Remy. Yeah, not everyone is going to um, is going to like the the things that they add to games, and not everyone's going to like every single game. You know, not every game is for everyone. You know, yeah, multiplayer. Yeah, waiting those two month updates is tough. It it is. That's why I stopped playing it. Like I played it to death when it came out, and then I dropped it. And then I played it to death when Stitch came out, and then I've dropped it, and now I'm probably going to play it to death now until I get everyone up to like level 10, and then I'm going to drop it again, you know? Um, it said, a princess races into the valley. Yes, I saw that as well. Yeah, and I was thinking um, Vanellope. Vanellope one sweet. That's exactly what I thought. And my daughter was like, oh, maybe it's going to be Cinderella. And I said, yeah, but look at the wording. It says races in. And she is a princess, right? I mean, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen the first Wreck-It Ralph, it's like 20 years old almost. It's, it's not. How old is, how old is Wreck-It Ralph? It's older than you think. But yeah, she, it turns out she's a princess at the end, right? Mm -hmm. You wanted it early because you wanted all the Star Quest items. I, I was grateful that the Halloween Star Path was um, longer because i was on holiday when it came out so it gave me time to go on holiday for two weeks come back and still finish it in time but i do feel like if they're gonna give us like 50 plus day star paths there needs to be more to do because i finished the last star path the christmasy one in the space of two weeks and it was 50 days long so you're like what do i do now what do i do and i, I get that i not everyone else is going to be doing it as quick as me but also there are people that do it quicker than me so it's, i don't know you think um prince charming from cinderella will be in the pumpkin house do you really i was thinking maybe um maybe the the fairy godmother but i don't know you normally finish it within a week yeah yeah same same a week or a week or two depending on how busy i am and how much time i get to get on the game you know if i've had like a quiet week and i can get on and and game properly then i'll do it faster but obviously if i'm like busy with kids off school or like if i'm doing video editing and stuff and i haven't had time then it might take me a little longer from the picture they shared of the yearly updates it looks like prince charming's outline to you It screams Harry Godmother to you. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because he'd be in a pumpkin. Well, who else could it be apart from, like, Jack Skeleton? But he doesn't live in a pumpkin. He lives in a tower, you know? Apart from him being the pumpkin king, there's nothing pumpkin about him. Who was it who was saying? Was it Kelly? Kelly, was it you who was saying that you thought that the green flames up in that area were to do with Bruno? 
from um, Encanto. And we are getting Encanto stuff now, aren't we? We're getting Mirabelle and stuff. And the mini casita. So yes. Are they knocking on the door? Or is it just pushing it through? Okay. I'll just need to go and get my, um, my post BRB. There I am. I'm back. <clears throat> what website shows the big yearly updates? Um. Oh, the purple highlighted character person. I think that that's not an outline of a character. I think that the purple highlighted character is supposed to be the for the forgetting, isn't it? It's like you. Yeah, it's the forgetting. It's you as a bad person, as the evil villain kind of person. And it just so happens that the person that they're using is that character. Like, it will look like you in the game, not that person, not that guy from that picture. So that, yeah, that's not, that's not Prince Charming. You know who I would love? Um, Tiana and Naveen. I think they would be really, really cool. And imagine if you could have them as like a frog. Um, you were like, that looks like a prince. Yeah, it's because the character that they're basing it off of is also a guy who's like wearing princely outfits and stuff. So yeah, but in your game, the, the forgetting looks like you. Um, but in villain clothing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I said that Tiana's come in. You could put her house in the in the swampy area. What's it called? The Glade of Trust. Yeah, I was like, I've forgotten how this game works. I've forgotten all the names. You excited for Simba and Nala? Yeah, there's gonna be a new realm and everything. It looks really, really good. I haven't, like I said, I haven't even got into the game. I haven't discovered anything. All I know is what you lot know from Twitter and Instagram and and things like that. That's literally all I know. <laughs> Right, um, that's my coffee done. Uh, we're going to be having a, a, a ad break, our first ad break in about five or so minutes. Uh, she likes the game, but she likes the items that come with the purchase as a gimmick, kind of like a cash grab. Oh, yeah. So, like, how you could buy the three different versions of it and the more expensive versions came with more stuff. Like, I was saying to people, oh, thank you for the stretch pink. Um, if you want to get it, but you're like, oh, I'm a bit on the fence about it, la, la, la. My advice would have been either wait for it to be free um, or get it on Game Pass, if it's still on Game Pass, which is essentially free, or get the cheapest version. Unless you really, 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 really want that like Cinderella looking dress. It's not really worth it for me. It's not really worth the, what is it, $69.99 or whatever it is? It, it's not, personally. Uh, having played it and having been privileged enough to get it for free, I can now state my opinion and say I wouldn't have paid 70 quid for it if I hadn't had it for free. You had to figure out how to word that without sounding like an ass. <laughs> I, it makes sense, it makes sense. I understand it completely and everyone is total to their opinion about the game of course um but i have to i have to agree i have to agree with your friend wish so, yeah and we have to remember that game loft are they make mobile games so whilst this is not a mobile game it functions very much like a mobile game so you're gonna have those microtransactions and you're gonna have those like starter packs where it'll be like buy this and get extra cosmetic stuff 
or extra in-game currency. You know? That, that's just how mobile games work. Imagine, look at Fortnite, right? Fortnite was free, but you pay for stuff in the game. Look, and then when Epic Games took over Fall Guys, that became a free-to-play game, but now you have to pay for all the in-game currency and all the skins and stuff. But it's all like, it's all cosmetic. None of it's like pay to win or anything. Um, you didn't know that the company behind it was a mobile games creator. Yeah, so I don't know if they only make mobile games, but if you've ever played a game called um, Disney's Magic Kingdoms, that is on mobile. I have it on my phone. I have it on my iPad. I haven't played it for a while, but that Game Loft make that as well. So it's very, very mobile game kind of feel to it you know what i mean <laughs> you know what i mean it's expensive though the castle for example look how much it works out to i will when we get in i will i'll have a look at how much it works out to so you got that's what you've got to look at isn't it how many moonstones does it cost and how much would you pay for those moonstones if you didn't already have them in your game just stacked up and i know that they've given us a way to get more in game for free but only 50 a day right 50 a day where these things are costing thousands yeah they're selling the moon stones for money exactly so you, their argument will be oh but if you save the moon stones up then you could get them but they change every five days you're only going to get 250 in five days and these items cost thousands like is it three thousand something like that you're never going to be able to get it you don't think you'll be able to actually use the Prime Store thingy? I won't. I know I won't. Right, let me put that reminder in chat. So we're just under a minute away from an ad. There's going to be three minutes worth of ads, um, but then that does keep us ad-free for a whole hour. And then once the ads are run, then we'll get into the game and we can see the new update. But thank you for hanging out with me while we've been chatting. And, uh, and I love to hear your opinions on it because I have some strong opinions, you know. <laughs> as it is but yeah take this time to uh to go grab a snack if you want to i'm not going to go anywhere i'm just going to keep chatting we've only been live for like half an hour so next time we have a big break though i will take a break i need my water how do ads work do you have to be an affiliate i don't think you do have to be an affiliate no i think that they work for everyone but you don't maybe get the money unless you're an affiliate i think if, you, if you're not an affiliate yet you might not get the money for it but yeah, so you might not see me now while the ads are going to start, but I'll still be here. I'm still above this chat. I got my drink of water. Ugh, I'm parched. I needed the caffeine for my coffee to wake me up because I'm so tired, but it also dehydrates me and I'm so thirsty. There we go. Oh, dear me. I love that you can see my glooby back there. <laughs> I love he's just sitting there smiling. Also, not that I'm sponsored by Dr. Glow in any way, but if you want to get one of the glooby plushies, I think they're still for sale on his store. I think that they, they're doing a second run and you can grab one. You just know that the ads confuse you, yeah. Goblin Mojo is very free. Shut up, Hank. <laughs> Until February 28th. Oh, good. Good. I knew it was... Um, it was soon ish is it like a two week long run or something or is it like a three weeks something like that something like that so yeah if you want to get yourself a glooby plush thank you catherine yeah there's his merch store we will support it's three weeks cool. and um it wasn't too wasn't too expensive and the shipping the shipping to the uk was like a fiver which blew me away i was like it's gonna be so much you got yours today did you really <gasps> Catherine, I know that you would wait longer being in, in Australia. The quality is good, isn't it? Like I said, I had one issue with it. Um, I'm just going to run that second set of ads and then we'll be back into the game. Bear with. Okay. I had one issue with it. Which... Oh, it's because he's so full of stuffing and he's really firm. It's popped the stitches a little bit on the back of his head. Um, but that's not a Dr. Go on issue, obviously. I'm gonna, I haven't emailed them yet, but I was gonna email Fourth Wall about that. 
just to see if they can do anything about it. Um, but it's tiny little, tiny little bit on the back of his head. But it is because he's so full of stuff in. Um, it always has no pop stitches. Well, that's good. It was just a one-off then. I've got a little bit of extra threading up the top here as well. Just like little bits. Other than that, they're really, really good. The fabric is lovely. It's really, really good. I'm very happy with it. Because I missed... I couldn't get the other one, the handmade ones that he did. But I was glad to get this one. It looks like you could use him as a hammer. He's solid. He's absolutely solid. Uh -uh. Say, there he is. It's so cute. He is. And um, I'm with that same merch store now. So maybe in the distant future when we're a larger community, we can have merch as well and have little plushies you know i would love am i sitting on my blanket i think so i would love to have a plushie of the mermaid gen in the dino onesie i think that would be really cute i would love that <laughs> but yeah i think you have to reach minimum orders you're done yay nice i'm excited to see those done they look really fun. Okay, we are out of the ads now. So let's switch over to this screen. I'm gonna pause my background music a second because there is music in the game if I remember correctly. Disney Dreamlight Valley. Okay, okay. Let's see, let's see how we go. So yeah, when we get a little bit bigger because there are minimum orders on the plushies because they're expensive to make. Um, I would love to be able to provide a plushie you guys to purchase if you would like to you know game loft let's see oh what the hell going again remind me yes thank you thank you pink thank you i was like remind me streamer mode i need to put streamer mode on i can't remember whether i played this on my own last or if i played it with you last because i would have put the the, Dis the disney music on if um i played it on my own last would 100% buy everyone, every push you off our witch. That's so sweet, especially considering you're like brand new to the community as well. Streamer friendly mode on. Sad times. I will play this later off, um, with that off so I can hear the new music and stuff. Okay, let's uh, continue where I left off from because I have not played this game in a long time. So I've forgotten where we were and what we were doing. Let me see. Look, this is not changed though, I have to say. I thought we were getting a new loading screen. We were supposed to be getting a new loading screen. Hmm. Hmm. We've got Elsa. We've got Stitch now. We've got Scar now. Oh, it's taken a while. It's taken a while to load. This is like the first one. Can you suggest something to look at? Of course, of course. Oh, they took the winter one away. Oh, okay. It really does look cute though. The Stitch's goals when you play. Stitch is lovely. I love Stitch. Stitch and Wally. I would die for Wally. I would kill for Wally. I would commit unspeakable crimes for Wally. Back to the original. Okay. I wondered whether they were going to put new key art on because with, with, um, Mirabelle and stuff. <gasps> Cutscene! Oh, look at the foxes! Ooh. Looking Remy's. I know about Remy's. I saw that on Lisa's. It looks very cool. <gasps> oh, oh, they're sparkly over there. Look how foggy it is. It really highlights how dirty my monitor screen is. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh, look how... Look. Yeah, I'm still in my Christmas outfit. <laughs> still in my christmas outfit with like um snowmen about the place and everything let me just go up here Ooh, event the centennial star path for the 100 oh thank you we get to get a platinum mickey oh that's cool okay okay my duties are remove the night thorns Mine garnet. I want to do this one. I want to do this one. I want to do. Um, I want. Hang on. Hang, how do I unlock the bigger thing though? I want to unlock that. The next one up. Do I just unlock it there? 
I want the premium because I want to get the next, like the extra hundred. Why can't I get the extra hundred? Is that going to give me the extra hundred though? Isn't there normally a thing here that says unlock that one and get the, get the extra hundred? Do you know what I mean? Let's look at the shop. Oh, yeah. It will take you to me. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. So this is 3,750 for the palace, which gives your house a, a new look, which is beautiful. 3,750. Right. Let's work out how expensive that is in real time money. I have my notebook, I have my pen, my phone's over there, so I'll do it on my calculator. 3750, right? Moonstone. <sighs> We'd have to get. You'd have to get this one plus this one, and that still wouldn't be enough. So you'd have to get the bigger one, I guess, which is £18, but that wouldn't be. So basically it works out to nine, um, maybe 15, 15 pound-ish. <sighs> oof, that's a big old oof, isn't it, that? Yeah, looking at about 15 quid's worth of Moonstone. I don't, hey, this is what I was talking about. This is what I was talking about. Here we go. Just to change the look of your house. Mate. We we do talk some crap about EA, but even EA would not stoop that low. I'm sorry, but you know, even EA would not do this. Look, what's that? Three items. Fifteen quid for three items. That one's even more. That one's four thousand. That one's four thousand eight hundred and fifty for what the bookshelf is that a TV maybe that's a whole unit actually the TV unit plus the TV that's one item this is just three items a chair a bookshelf and a TV and to get that amount of moonstone you're looking at this pack which is eighteen pound that one's forty five. Damn it, game loft. When you're more greedy than EA, you know there's an issue. So that's only the 250 if you log on every day, so it's crazy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna do this one. <laughs> My god. Hey, get the extra hundred. So now I have eighteen thousand five hundred and thirty. And I have all of these unlocked now. Okay, so I need to remove some night fawns, mine some garnets, hang out with Mickey for an hour, start eight daily discussions, harvest 60 carrots, and cook 10 two-star meals. Yeah, you trash EA for Sims 4. Yeah, <laughs> I trash EA for Sims 4 and their greediness, but it's if EA are going to charge you 15 quid for something, it's not for three items, you know? Yeah, 700 plus USD for the full game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Aww, pink. That's really sweet. <laughs> yeah, I always go with the big, um, the big path. I always do, because then it gives you six chances to do the thing, doesn't it? Rather than just the three. So oh, I can't. I can't believe that. I do want the palace, but also, mm, that's a lot. That is a lot. Let's look at my quests. Oh, look at these. The Great Blizzard. This is a new one. Mm -hmm. An enchanted blizzard has started in the Frosted Heights. You'll need to investigate to find out what's going on. And we're going to get that creepy squirrel. There's a magical blizzard in the Frosted Heights. Consult with Merlin. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is consult with Merlin. Wherever Merlin may be. Where is he? Where is Merlin today? Merlin is in his house. I've forgotten where everything is in this map, I'll be honest. I've forgotten how to do anything. Hey, Scar. I haven't played it for months. It's a lot considering it's the currently a paid game. Exactly. This is what we were talking about, right? I could understand them bringing in microtransactions eventually because it's a free-to-play game. But it's not currently a free-to-play game. Maybe they're testing the waters and they can see how much they can get away with charging. Do you know what I mean? You think they brought them in too soon? Yeah. The star path you did 
um, the smaller price one on the first one, so it unlocks the six things. But if you get the more expensive one, you get the hundred moon stars more at the end. Yes, you do. You do. Right. Look how it's all foggy. You won't be able to do the new quest for a little bit. You started over. Did you really? Oh, I forgot. Is he trapped? Are you trapped? No, he's fine. But get get out of the corner. Get out of the corner. Well, hello. I got him in his Santa outfit from the Christmas one. They can change the price at any point. They can. They could make it go up or they can make it go down depending on the reaction from the community. So if we are vocal about how much we hate it and we think it's um, greedy, they might bring it down, but I doubt it. I, I highly doubt it. Jenny, precisely who I was hoping Did to see. I... I'm certain you've noticed a rather snowy problem we have well, on our I... hands. Uh, do... There's a blizzard in the Frosted Heights, but it isn't a mere meteorological happenstance. There's dark magic afoot. I like Merlin. I think he's cool. I love Sword in the Stone. It's a really good film. It's underrated in my opinion. Magical blizzard? That sounds like a job for Elsa. Well, ordinarily, I'd say yes, but I do mean to consult her. But there's something quite unnatural about this storm. I fear even Elsa's magic won't be able to quell it. Are you saying that Elsa's natural? Mm. Um, what a magical mess. What should we do? Ah, yes. To set this right, we'll need to restore the pillar in the Frosted Heights. Yay! We've not been able to do that for a while. Um, that should keep the vexing dark magic at bay. Oh, who was I watching? Um, it might have been Tinksy. And Tinksy was saying that they wanted to decorate the frosted heights area but you because the pillar isn't done yet it's still like all surrounded in the dark magic you can't move it or something and they were really really annoyed about that but now we'll be able to restore it and then it'll be movable um your account on the of his xbox game pass so you had to stop for a little bit and he bought himself a coffee oh no see did you lose everything that sucks and the golden potato as well, which I still know nothing about. Elsa did have powers via natural means. To be true, true. Have you seen Frozen 2? It explains why she's got them. How do I restore the pillar? I suppose I'll need to find the orb like the well, others. I, I... Precisely, but I'm afraid it's easier said than done. The orb has been missing in the Frosted Heights since shortly after the forgetting began. I do, Sarah. Yes, I do. Um... And it, oh dear, it's been missing so long. I can't remember which virtue powered its magic. What could it have been? Uh, not chewing with your mouth open. <laughs> Why, that's just basic manners and decency, Jenny. Unless you're a dog, of course. Not exactly within their nature. Oh, but whatever powered this pillar was something more elemental. So like Elsa then, basically. What it was, I'm afraid, you'll have trouble finding the orb. That blizzard means you won't be able to see an inch beyond your nose. Discord spoiler channels are sharing tips on using it with this update. You haven't tried anything though. Oh, really? You liked Frozen 2, though your niece has sensory overload. You don't blame it though. Some of the scenes were. Some of them were. Yeah. It was. It's, some of our parts of it are quite intense, aren't they? If I remember. Oh. I've only seen it a couple of times. I recently. Um, I, I went on holiday in October. Um, to florida and we did all the disney stuff so in the 60 days prior to our, our like departure day i did a movie marathon with disney movies and i watched every single one of the 60 animated classics in canon that were on disney plus every single day one a day all the way through so i did i have recently watched all the disney films but um everything from snow white up to encanto Frozen 2 is definitely in there. That so was good. There's there's a couple of us that I didn't watch because they're not on Disney Plus, like Song of the South, which I wouldn't want to watch anyway. And um, Make Mine Music, I think, wasn't on there as well for similar reasons. Um, well, I'll say that they did keep some of the other stuff on Disney Plus, which has got more racial tensions in it, but they have that like warning thing at the beginning of the film now. But yeah, I, I enjoyed that movie marathon. I uh, thought it was good. Um... You have Disney Plus, but it just sits there. Yeah, I watch. Um, we don't watch a lot on Disney Plus, to be honest. We do more Netflix than Disney Plus, I'd say. But I'll just try to get my use out of it, you know, because it's expensive, isn't it? You love Encanto. I love Encanto. I do. It's really good. It's definitely up there in my top five. Okay, I suggest you start by investigating the center of the mystical activity. You must search the blizzard for the source of the disturbance. 
And act quickly, the storm is growing larger. If we don't stop it soon, I fear it will swallow up the entire valley. <laughs> oh, and Jenny, I suggest you dress for the weather. It's going to be downright frigid. Well, okay, so I need to... I mean, I am dressed for winter. Look at me, I'm in a Christmas dress. Could I not be any more Christmassy? Um, you probably watch more Disney Plus now, to be honest. Especially as they've added crime shows. Oh yeah, because they've got like all star and stuff on there, haven't they now? So it's not just Disney's Disney stuff. Right, let's go to the Frosted Heights. That's Forest of Valor. Here we go. Ooh. Hello. It's cold up here. Imagine if they had like um like your breath of the wild where you actually got cold and you needed to dress something warm there's some flowers while i'm up here as well uh anything up here hello shout out to disney plus for low-key monopolizing hey <laughs> yay capitalism um anything here here's the the thing right can't do anything with it. Oh, 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 sparklies. Sparklies. Hello? Can I? It's a diggy thing. Um, I've forgotten how to do the diggy things. I've forgotten how to do it. I've forgotten. I've forgotten. Where's my thing? Is it this one? Yes. No, it's not that one. It's three. Thank you. <laughs> I've forgotten the buttons. Oh, dear. You put a chest next to each biome for the flowers oh that's really a good idea actually that's a really good idea oh 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 footprints in the snow oh <gasps> atlantis that's atlantis that's atlantis that's atlantis it's tab for the wheel oh good <gasps> oh look it's olaf and the like demon squirrels that's a wardrobe in the wall what is going on a what what's going on hello hello you f oh you found me oh, look at a laugh oh hooray that means i'm it <laughs> now it's your turn to hide my advice choose a good spot anna says my finding abilities are epic olaf <laughs> The demon school is cute, it is. So yeah, I know. He stole his nose and he hasn't got any arms to grab it back. They must have stolen his arms as well. Um, it's you. Wait, you look taller than I remember. I suppose the last time we saw each other was a long time ago. Way back before the forgetting. Does that mean you're grown up now? Uh, that's right. Oh. Well, I hope you're not too grown up to finish playing our game. Um, do you think we can feed Donald to the demon schools? Oh, no, don't. I love Donald and I love his little tantrums as well. <laughs> I know that people hate it. I love him. Hey Dev, hi. So like when you hear that little train whistle go off and you're like he's gonna have a little tantrum I have to go and run over to him and make sure he's okay because I love him. Now it's your turn to hide. My turn to seek. Yeah I saw that. Yeah yeah so they've added more conversations between characters which is nice. Let's hide and seek later, but first, what is this place? This law of you actually in the game? Yeah, 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 apparently. Apparently so. You're the first one I've heard say that. I love Donald. I know. I've, I have a soft spot for an underdog, okay? I'm always the person who likes people that people don't like, apart from Clint. There, I would agree with the majority of the Stardew team, people community in hating Clint but I love Donald Duck Goofy's the best I'm not a massive fan of Goofy I don't hate him he's all right but yeah Donald's lovely I need you know what we need we need Daisy that's why he's so upset he's been in the Navy blessing he's probably got PTSD he needs Daisy to help calm him down Where, where's Daisy game laughed bring us Daisy He's just trying to be a good dad. Yeah. Oh, Goofy, like Goofy. Goofy is canonically a father, right? Um, your carer's husband is called Donald. So when you're playing the game and your carer's here, you'll yell Donald. <laughs> she always laughs. 
Daisy always highlights the best in Donald. Exactly, exactly. She'll bring out the best in him and calm him down, I think. We need her in the game. Plus, she's sassy and I love her. Uh, well, you came here when you wanted to be alone. Oh, this is ass for secret room? Mm -hmm. To get away from all the complexities of life and to ponder the meaning of the universe. Uh, that makes sense. We all need time <laughs> to be alone. That is so true. There's so much strange magic in here. I wonder where it all comes from. As do I. This truly is a chamber filled with mysteries. And what well. happened to you? Well, I followed you in here one day and there was a bright flash of light. <laughs> and then you were gone and i've been here ever since mainly because i couldn't get out <gasps> he's been in here all this time and he remembers us when we were little so he's been in here years that is awful <laughs> well i did get lonely and i missed you and all my friends <laughs> but i've composed 12 epic novels in my head while i've been here it's a series i'll recite them to you later <gasps> oh, Olaf, can you help me fix this magical mess there's a magical blizzard that's been threatening the whole village. If we're going to stop it, we need to find the orb and restore the pillar. Ooh, I very much want to help, but first I'm in need of some assistance myself. You probably noticed that I'm missing my nose, my buttons, and my arms. Yeah, uh, I didn't want to make a big deal about it. <laughs> Thank you. That was very polite. I'll help you get all your parts back. I think when I came in, I saw the squirrels carrying them off. <gasps> Oh, right, silly me. Those squirrels are my friends. Did you know there are over 200 species of squirrels? But the ones here don't look like squirrels I've seen before. They're all mysterious and glowing. Still, they like to play keep away with me, which is nice. It helps pass the time. They take my buttons and nose and I chase them around and get them back. They don't sound like your friends, Olaf. They sound like they're being bullies, I'll be honest. Yeah, are you sure it's just a game? Well, I thought so. <laughs> But as for the squirrels, well, who can really comprehend the mind of a squirrel? But this time, when you came in, the squirrels ran out right past you with my nose and buttons. I've only ever had to ch chase them around here before. Okay, I'll help you get them back. Great, let's chase down some squirrels. Okay, can I look around here first, though? Look at this, everything's, like, floating. And there's, like, some weird stuff on the walls. What's going on here? This is spooky, scary. Oh, oh, there's something on the floor down here. What is this? Oh, a memory. What is it a memory of? <gasps> I try to make friends with the villagers, but it's like there's a wall between us. Like something is broken inside of me. All right. Okay. Mm. Look at all these gems on the wall. So it looks like we've been doing some experiments in here. Um, am I stuck back here? I think I'm stuck. Let me come out. Um, oh, there's another piece of paper here. Another memory. You gotta go and get some stuff done. <gasps> oh, no worries. It's so amazing to come to an open community after having a rough day. Oh, thank you so much. That's so sweet of you. I'll be live again. What day is this today? Friday? I'll be back on... Oh, no, I won't be back on Tuesday. I was gonna say I'd normally do Tuesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, but I am taking Tuesday off next week. I, d I forgot to tell everybody, but I'll be back again Thursday. And in the meantime, I'll be on YouTube, so. Yeah, that's that's a reminder. So, um, next week in the UK, for my kids' schools at least, it's half term. So, they're taking the week off, and we're going out on the Tuesday. So, I won't be live. So, just bear that in mind. You'll be here on Thursday. Yay! You're going to listen while you play. No worries, Sarah. You do that. You play alongside. It's fun. So, this is this is the new one? No. Which is the new one we just got given? Which was the new memory we just got given? Was it this one? Which one? I don't even remember what the new one was. No, it wasn't any. I haven't opened it, that's why. I haven't opened it. No wonder there wasn't a new one. I have to tear out the orb to cast my spell. There's no other choice. Scary stuff. Um, is there... There's another piece of paper down here. Look at this memory. What is this one? It's not working. Nothing is working. It must be the pillar's magic stopping me. Uh oh. I feel like this is a a color puzzle. Though in from my experience in playing games with puzzles in it, I'm gonna guess we've gotta put a purple one here, because of red and blue, so amethyst. And then this will be an orange one, so topaz. And then this one will be green, so peridot. That's my guess. We'll see how right I am. 
Um, or maybe emeralds, but maybe peridot, because it's quite a light yellow. I don't know. I left something in here. Something I need. I know it's here somewhere. I need to tear down the wall. Ooh. And there's a piece of paper on the other side. There's two more pieces of paper on the other side. Oh, another piece. It's only when the lights are on that I realize my life is dark. In here, I'm safe. My god, this is dark stuff. Disney. This is meant to be Disney. Hello? The spell. It went wrong. Need to find somewhere else, somewhere quieter. Might need to rip out all the orbs to do this. Oh, so maybe that's how everything ended up messed up in the end. Can I go through here? I don't think I can go into the portal. Do I want to go into the portal? Probably not. So we need to go find some squirrels, right? Let's go find them. That's dark stuff. Right, squirrels. Let's um, see if we can find them, shall we? Chase down the scary squirrels to get all those buttons back. Okay, I've got four to find. If we can find, I can't see them anywhere. It's so dark and foggy and blizzardy. <gasps> there's a fox. The lore is so good. Yes, there's quite a lot of lore, which is always good. I do appreciate a lot of lore in a game. Baby, no worries there. Um, oh, there's more um, of these. More night thorns, because i got to do these for the... The star path, haven't I? Plus, this is the blue chest. I should get 50 of these, right? 50 moonstones. Yes, it did work. Thank goodness. Let's get some of these removed. How foggy. Squirrels, hello. There's a gem over there, at least. And... Let's cross over. Hello. I don't know where they'll be. I mean, squirrels live on the plateau, right? On the plaza, even. I do, yeah. All Christmassy still. And my little Christmassy fox. I haven't played it literally since the Christmas. I finished the Christmas um, star path, <laughs> basically. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Any more back here? Nope. Oh, also, there was meant to be a glitch. I think they went, they might have fixed it, I don't know. Where you were supposed to get unlimited coal now from Christoph's stall. So let's have a look and see if that's fixed. I know Lisa said it was broken yesterday. Here is, there's coal here. So, I can do 99. Ah ha ha, that's good, that's good. Shows if or when I want to hint, I will, don't worry, don't you worry about that. So yeah, it looks like they fixed that. We can get coal from Kristoff now. Because that was the thing that was holding me back, I'll be honest, was the amount of coal we needed to cook with all the time. Because you make more money from the um, from the pumpkin puffs than you do from the pumpkins themselves. Let's go this way. But I was running out of coal, so I was just making pumpkin money instead of pumpkin puff money. Let's see, squirrel, 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 where are you? Haven't seen any yet. Oh, 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 that's a normal squirrel, isn't it? That's the normal one. Hi. I don't have anything for you. Oh, what's this? Can I not? No, I don't have any um, peanuts for it. They like peanuts, don't they? Any squirrels here? Hi, Maui. Hi, Moana. Let's go down to the meadow. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, I have a completely out of quest context question. Have you ever drunk milk out of a saucer? No. <laughs> no, I have not. I missed that one. Sorry, Catherine. Um, no. Oh, oh. <gasps> a golden doorknob. What? What? You found a golden doorknob. You should bring it to Merlin. Maybe he can tell you more about it. We know what that belongs to. That's Mirabelle's. 
That's Mirabelle's. Let's go. Where is Merlin? Is he home still? Because we're like right by his house. We might as well. I don't like milk, Catherine, like in general. I don't drink milk on its own. But no. Uh, give. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, hello. How marvelous! A golden doorknob with an M engraved on it. Now, this may not like look like much, Jenny, but it's proof your efforts against the forgetting are bearing fruit. I found this lying around the village. Oh, no, that was me, not him. Um, must be someone locked out of the home. Well. No, no, no. Not to worry, Jenny. This golden doorknob belongs to a charming lass named Mirabel Madrigal. You wanted to hear. Um, you wanted her to feel at home, so with my help, you enchanted her house to remind her of where she's from. The enchantment gave the building the power to reflect Mirabel's kindness and energy, but even <laughs> so, we never expected <laughs> Mini Casita to become quite so magical and so protective of its inhabitant. What do you mean? When the forgetting struck, Mirabel, like so many of us, started to lose her memories. Then one day, her house wasn't there anymore. I quickly went to investigate, and what I discovered astonished me. To protect Mirabelle, her home disappeared into a small universe of its own. <gasps> Does that mean it's a realm? Is that a realm? Finding the golden doorknob can only mean one thing. Mini Casita is considering coming back. But first, you'll need to prove that if the valley is safe once again. Oh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Marvellous. Oh, no, we see Elliot. Now... Houses believe in deeds, not words, and houses often come to reassemble, no, resemble, not even, not reassemble, resemble their inhabitants. To prove the value safe from Mirabelle, you have to embody the Madrigal's values. You're doing this right now? Awesome. What are the Madrigal's values? Well, I'm told they always believe in bringing their village together to help the community, and I remember Mirabelle checking in on everyone here to ensure their needs were fulfilled. Oh, and she became quite fond of photographs, if that helps. Hmm, I could take some pictures of the villagers. As to making sure everyone's needs are fulfilled, I could check what the villagers need and give them some gifts. Fine idea, Jenny. Why, simply engaging some of the villagers in conversation might be enough. After all, everyone appreciates being thought of. Take this golden doorknob. It's infused with dream light. Mm. So the more acts of kindness you perform, the more magic it will gain. Once it has enough, Mini Casita will return. I'll give you this trial run. I'll talk to you once I'm done. Okay, cool. I could have done better myself. So, can we, yeah, take pictures with three different villagers, give three, two different villagers their favorite gifts, or just give one villager two favorite gifts, I guess, and then have two daily discussions. Well, that's easy peasy. We can do a daily discussion with Merlin while we're well, right hello. here, actually. Oh, oh, hello. Um, do you have time to talk? Ah, yes. I can tell by the look on your face that you have a question for me. What is it? Uh, how do you do magic? There's no simple answer to that, but I can say it takes years of study. One must understand the nature of, well, nature and how to influence it. That is the secret to true power. Knowledge. I tip my hat to you. You're okay. It, though I, I prefer not to take it off. Can I, can I gift to you? It's not letting me go back and talk to him. I wanted to go back and gift to him if I could. Right, so let's have a look for these squirrels. Oh yeah, I forgot I hadn't picked all this up. <laughs> all this mess that Stitch did. I have not cleaned it up yet. Um, I haven't seen the squirrels yet. Oh yeah, I still have the Christmas tree out because, like I said, not played it since Christmas. There's a rabbit. Oh, a chest. What's in this one? Money. Okay. Uh nothing here oh there's anna can i talk to anna <coughs> oh excuse me oh. anna anna talk to me anna hey, there you go here. wow i'm happy to see you we'll do your daily discussion oh. okay have you eaten stretched had plenty of fluids oh she's doing the self-care check oh. oh i am thirsty actually you should go get a drink it's easy to get dehydrated it even happens to elsa you think that since she has ice powers, it wouldn't, but it doesn't work that way. Yeah, because Anna's I Anna, Elsa's ice powers, it's basically just water power, isn't it? Basically. <laughs> just water power, but cold. Come back here, I need to talk to you. Uh, hi. Um, what gifts do you like? 
Um, ice cream. Oh, a white passion lily. Did I not pick some of these up? That's a white passion lily. Here, give that. There's one. Hey. Wow. This is for me. Thank you. Uh, we'll talk later. Um, in the meantime, so does that count? That's two of those done. That's one of those done. And photographs is six, isn't it? Photographs is six. <laughs> so let me take a picture with you and catch up. Oh, I got her eyes nearly shut. That's fine. Close that. And we'll go down to the beach. See if we can find those squirrels down here. Hello? Oh, there's some night thorns down here as well, so we can get those. Oh, helps. Is that one over there? It is. We get rid of this big one, otherwise I will forget it's there. I need to get rid of... Is it 30? For the, the star path thing? Let's see. Can we find Ursula, maybe? Look how foggy it is down here. Oh, I thought that was actually Maui then. You should see a statue. It's like, hey, let's go and get a picture with Maui. Um, nope. Just some money. Oh, there's a chest over there. Go and grab that. Let's see what's in there. Oh, yeah. Thoughts? Anybody have any thoughts on the Skull Rock? I reckon it's going to be Captain Hook. I think Captain Hook's going to come out of there and then we might get Peter Pan. I don't think it's Pirates of the Caribbean at all. I definitely think it's Peter Pan themes. Um, that's some more money. There's some more night thorns. Oh, oh, it'll be one of those. You were kind of hoping for Captain Jack Beater now. Yeah, I think a lot of people were hoping for Pirates of the Caribbean, but it's literally Skull Rock, which is from um, Peter Pan. It's where they take Princess Tiger Lily. So I do think it's going to be Hook. Um, squirrel. Oh, look, it's my babes. Hi, Donald. Hi. <gasps> oh, it does make more sense. Yeah, exactly. Um, I ha Can I gift you anything? Do you want anything that I have? A green passionately. Funnily enough, I have one. There you go. Look how happy he is. Oh, I love you. Um, okay, I can't talk now, but you know what? Let's take a picture with you. Let's take a picture. Hey, Donald. Hi. Oh, his eyes went weird, but I am going to keep that one. <laughs> Is that good? Are we done? Did that do that one? Oh, we need to take another picture. Three. It was three pictures, not just two. That's fine. We can find someone else. Um, nothing here. Are the squirrels even anywhere? I haven't seen any at all. You have to hang with Donald for an hour, so at least our temper tantrums. Oh, I should be hanging with Mickey, shouldn't I? Mickey needed to be hanging out with as well. We'll go and find Mickey in a sec. Let me just do a quick once over of the glade and see if I can see any squirrels. No, my look. I'm looking in the wrong place for him. But it's fine. I can have a look around and remember where everything is, because it's been a long time. Oh, the little crocodiles. I would love to put like a Tiana and Naveen house down here. Because it kind of looks a bit Bayou-esque. I think it's very pretty. Oh, we were talking... Welcome back, Dev. We were talking in Lisa's yesterday. Um, we think that we, as a person, our character, might be Atlantean. It feels like that's where we're pointing. We write Our little diary things are written in Atlantean language. And, like, that secret room, the, our secret room, it had, like, a big Atlantean seal on the door. So, we might be from Atlantis. Um, you like that they have lined up um, well for you? Mickey was your gardener, so doing the carrots quest was good. Oh, yeah! He's Mickey, my gardener. Mickey might be a forager for me, I can't remember. But yeah, I need to go and do some carrots as well, don't I? 60 carrots. Go find him. Mickey. <sighs> hey, Moana. Morning. Mickey, where are you? Oh, he's over there. He's close. We can take our picture with Mickey, and then that'll be our third picture for that Mirabelle quest. Hi. Hello. 
Let's take a picture with you. Ooh, fancy. I will, don't worry. I know. Um, talk to you. Um, let's hang out. Oh yeah, he's a forager, not a gardener. Never mind. Um, chase down the scary schools to get Olaf's buttons back. So doesn't say where they'll be but let's go back up to frozen heights the frosted heights again because i feel like maybe they're gonna be up there and i've just missed them because i couldn't see them anywhere else unless unless we haven't been over here because this is kind of the scary land are you in here scary people scary scary squirrels Ooh. I don't see um see all this green fire Kelly was saying that um she reckoned that this might be to do with Bruno oh the ravens I haven't got any of the ravens yet they need they're expensive they like food at like five star meals and stuff yeah I don't see them here at all I've got a feeling that I would see them even in this dark gloomy area because they're like purple and glowy I always get lost up here as well. I'm like, um, um, which way is it back down again? Which way? How do I get out? Hello? Uh, nope. It's not this way. It's not this way. Is it? Is it? Is it? Am I lost? I'm a little bit lost. I will find my way out. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll get there. Let's see. If I follow the edge. If I just stick to the edge, eventually I'm gonna end up down in this in the plateau, right? Stick to the edge, there we go. There we are, down on the plateau. Ah, nice. Oh, there's Woody. Hey. Um I don't see anything. Okay. Do you use wells? Being here yeah, sometimes. I do. But I wanted to look around as well. So like, there's nothing here. So now I want to go straight back over to the um, the frosted area again. So now I will use my my well. Okay. Oh 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 oh. Check you. Got there. We are. Got one. Sometimes who won't use the wells at all? Really? Nah, I will. Feels cheating, but it's in the game. Not cheating if it's in the game. We know this. Right, I need another. Another one? That's what you said? Yeah. Got the carrot. I need one more for an extra button. And then where's his arms? Did we still not get any for his arms? Hey, squirrels. There's that fart. Hello, squirrels. Where are ya? It's so hard to see up here. Oh, oh, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Go, 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 come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. There we go. Now I can go back and give this to Olaf, right? Return to the secret chamber and bring Olaf his nose and buttons. Where's the secret chamber? <laughs> I couldn't remember. That's like not using the map in The Sims, right? Here it is, look. See? See, Dev? See the symbol on the door? You tell me that's not Atlantean. Those are Atlantean alphabet symbols right there. And we put our hand on it to open it. Um, here we go. Give. Imagine if I just cancelled it. <laughs> there you go. Happy buttons. You got my nose and my buttons back. Thank you. I feel much more like myself now. Hey, did you know that squirrels use their tails to help them balance in high places? I did know that. That's so cool. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Squirrels are a source of almost infinite interesting Whoa. facts. And now we have one to add. They like playing keep away <laughs> with carrots. Are you ready, little nose? Time to put you back where you belong. Oh, did we get to do like the shoving it into his face thing? Oh, oh, we didn't. Oh, this is so much better. I'd give you a warm hug to say thanks, but I'm still missing my arms. So that would be difficult. Um, they're going to be somewhere. Oh, I just remembered. It's not only my arms that are missing. They were holding something when I lost them. Mm. Is it the orb by any chance? 
Yeah, didn't you say you were looking for some kind of orb? Mm hmm Well, I was holding one when I got locked in here. Don't you just love coincidences? I guess I do. So we find your arms and we find the orb. Great. Excellent deductive reasoning, Jenny. <laughs> oh, we can also deduce that if I don't know what happened to my arms, I don't know what happened to the orb. Well, that's not useful at all, is it? Uh, you don't know what happened to your arms? As I said before, all I remember is that I walked in here and there was a flash of light. Then next thing I knew, my arms were gone and I and so was the orb and I was locked inside. Uh, if only there was some way to tell exactly what happened in here, but it was so long ago. Well, if you don't remember, and I don't remember, maybe the water remembers. The water remembers? What do you mean? Oh, water has a memory. It's disputed by many, but it's true. We'll just need to find a way to get it to share the memories with us. Hmm. Say, would Elsa know something about this? <gasps> Elsa, that's it. She's very good at helping Water show us what it remembers. All right, I'll go talk to Elsa. Right, where is Elsa? Let me go find her. Elsa, 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 please be somewhere close by. Elsa. Uh. Okay, she's not close by. Um. She's in Remy's. Oh, yeah, I'm going to look in Remy's, right? If you haven't seen it, I saw this yesterday when I went into Lisa's, but if you haven't seen inside Remy's and how it's changed, it's changed. So we got your three tables over here as normal. And then look at these three tables this side as well. So many more people can eat in the restaurant at one time now. <sighs> and does, is it just me or does this look different? I don't remember there being jams in here before. Or maybe I just wasn't paying attention. It's so pretty, isn't it? Okay, Elsa, I know you wanted my hero quickie, but um, I need Hi ya. There. Thank goodness you're here. I've been doing everything I can to try and stop the blizzard in the frosted oh. heights. But nothing I do seems to work. It has some sort of dark dreamlike magic feeding it. I think I might have found the key to fixing it, but I do need your help. <laughs> of course, anything. Just tell me what I should do. I went to the center of the blizzard and found the secret chamber full of strange magical experiments. There's a lot of words in this game. All the clutters knew. Is it? I did wonder. And that's not all. I found Olaf inside. <gasps> Olaf! Oh, yeah. what a relief! And I have been so worried about him. Did he know anything about the blizzard? Uh, he knew a little, but we need to find yes. out more. What did he say? Olaf's arms are missing. And he says the last thing he remembers is that they were holding onto the orb and we need that to restore the pillar. But he doesn't know where to find them. He said something about water having memory. <laughs> That's it. Or I could be a bit of a genius, but I'm not sure my powers will help. Whatever happened may not be tied closely enough to me. <laughs> but you might be able to help to do it. In the past, your royal watering can could draw the memories by held by the water. Ooh, our watering can? Cool. Hmm, then maybe we could find out exactly what happened to the orb. Do you think my watering can still has that power? I wouldn't know where to start. My friend Grandpa B would say to start where things began, and that would be the pillar of the Frosted Heights. I'll keep trying to fend off this blizzard while you hmm. investigate. Just hold your watering can and focus the magic near the pillar. Goodbye. Okay. Hey, Eric. This is my husband, by the way. Um, Ariel doesn't know that yet, but he is. You should see the way he looks at me when we're together. Right, let's go back up to the Frosted Heights. Zoom. Ah, oh, dear me. Where's the pillar? Where is the pillar? Here it is. Okay. Bring my watering can out. Use a watering can on the sparkling water particles. Oh, here? Oh, okay. There'll be no worries. <gasps> That's me! All evil! And holding on to... Let's hold on to the orb. Did I did I do this? Is this all my mess? Now I need to go back and find Elsa again. Elsa. Oh, you couldn't just come with me, could you? She has to just, like, stay in the restaurant. Backwards and forwards to the mean Remy's. Oh, while we're down here, actually, I want to go and look inside Scrooge's. I don't think I have enough money to buy stuff, but... Um... I get this village. <gasps> People have moved around. Hang on. Minnie was... Eating at this table with Goofy, and Eric was at this table by himself. And now Elsa's talking with Eric. What's going on here? Um, did your watering can uncover anything? I saw the forgotten taking the orb from the pillar. 
Oh, well, I spent a lot of time talking to Merlin about magic in the village. He told me that the pillars have protective charms on them to keep dark magic mm. at bay. Maybe the Forgotten wanted to try using more dangerous kinds of magic, and the pillars' protective aura was stopping that. Elsa, there's something I need to tell you. The Forgotten. They're a part of me. Some kind of splinter of myself that I left behind. I see. He's <laughs> musical chairs, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I know that magic can do things like that. Olaf is a part of me. He's sweet and kind, but so is Marshmallow, a much larger snowman I created. And he's, let's just say he's very protective. So if the Forgotten wanted to make a mess with dark magic, does that mean I did too? Um, it definitely sounds like something I would do. <laughs> well, you do seem to be a curious person. Sometimes things call to you, you just have to follow. Maybe that's the part of yourself that the Forgotten represents. All that curiosity. But... That this would mean that the blizzard, the forgetting, could all be my yeah. fault. What? No, Jenny, this isn't mm. your fault. Trust me. When it comes to starting magical blizzards that threaten to swallow up everything and everyone I love, mm. I've got a little experience. Back again, no worries, though. Um, magic and emotions can make unintended things happen. The more you know about your magic, the more you'll be able to control it. <laughs> what matters now is that you're here, trying to fix it. And I guess now we're one step closer to doing that. No worries. You've got you've got a lot on your hands at the minute, Dev, and that's absolutely understandable. You, if you need to dip out to take care of him, don't worry about it. I understand completely. Um, mm. I think you'll find the rest of the answers inside. Okay, should be okay now. Cool. How how is your mom? Is she feeling any better? Oh, thank you for the hydrate pink. <clears throat> I need that. There's so much talking in this game. I had forgotten. Um, I'll go and see if there's any more memories inside the secret like chamber. Well, I did already do all the memories though, didn't I? Unless there's more appeared. Uh, return to Olaf in the secret chamber. Okay. She's slightly better. Oh, good. I mean, slightly better than not better at all. But yeah, I hope she gets even more better. On the up at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I keep forgetting where this wall is, which direction it is. Uh, here it is. Here it is. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> Ella! So look, there's more like floating water particles here. So I'm going to guess we're going to need to use our watering can on those. Oh, good. You're here. <gasps> that, is that his actual voice? Is that Josh Gad? That sounds like Josh Gad. Wait, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Um, Disney Dreamlight Valley IMDB. Is that Josh Gad? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. He's not listed. He's not listed, but he might be. Top cast. I want to see the cast. I want to see it. <laughs> Is he there? I know that Jodie Benson's in it, which makes me cry because I blooming love Jodie Benson. And Pat Carroll was in it before she died. Um, no. Although to be fair, it's Jake Green. Who the heck is Jake Green? Who are you? You're not Josh Gad. You're not Josh Gad. Go away with your fake. Olaf, you heard that they already voiced lines from the movie. New lines have added other voice actors. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, that's not him. I think so. Elsa helped me with my watering can to bring out the memory in the pillar in the forest. Frosted Heights. I saw the Forgotten pulling the orb from the pillar. It looked just like you. Yeah, the Forgotten has my face. Are there some sort of magical splinter of me? Oh, like I'm a part of Elsa. How fascinating. I guess it's sort of like that. Well, I certainly thought the Forgotten was you when we were playing hide and seek. You'd been missing for a long time, but we were still in the middle of the game. So I followed you, or the Forgotten, so I could tag you and you finally came back to the village. And then I saw the Forgotten had dropped that shiny orb, so I picked it up and came in here to give it back. But then what happened? Um, I don't remember, but you can use your watering can around here if you want to find out. Okay, we'll use our watering can here. <gasps> oh 
I just snatched it from him and his arms came out. That's so violent. <laughs> what the heck? And then there's some more over here by the portal. And then what? And then I just threw it through. <laughs> the forgotten is not... Yeah. I mean, I kind of love her. But also... As a oh, me. So glad you made it. Did you see that? I must have interrupted the forgotten while they were casting some sort of magical enchantment. Huh? Come to play. <gasps> yeah, you're going to love it. The orb made the magic go wild in here. That must have been the flash I saw. So this chamber, it must be the Forgotten's. And it was the Forgotten who locked you inside it. So yeah, he was playing hide and seek with them and not me. Um, I'm so sorry that happened. That's okay. I know you wouldn't have wanted it to happen. After all, the Forgotten grabbed the orb off the floor and threw it through that portal over there. <laughs> Poor thing. He was so confused. Uh, right, there's going to be another set of ads in about two minutes' time. This time, I will be taking a proper break. So, um, before the ads start, I'm going to go to my BRB screen and uh, and go take a break. But we'll just finish this line of dialogue and stuff first. <gasps> oh, but bright side, now we know where the orb is. Someone with arms could just reach inside and get it. I volunteer, but uh, I have no arms. <laughs> oh, poor thing. Oh, 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 you're doing a heist? I want to do the heist. I want to join in the heist. I want a heist. <laughs> that portal keeps flickering. Something's wrong with it. I don't think it's safe to reach inside um, there. Yeah, I wouldn't go putting your arms inside magical portals, I will laugh. Since my arms are missing, I couldn't just turn the pages and read them, but the titles are very interesting. Uh, and they're all about magic, casting spells, and making things float, and how to open portals. Did you just say how to open portals? Gasp! How to open portals? Yes, and we need to open a portal. I guess I need to find that book then, okay? Oh, thanks. Um, here we go, here it is. And talk to Olaf, I found it. Okay, where is he? Back here again still. Oh, good, you're here. You found a book, it's all we need. You have to read it to me since I can't turn the pages. It's called, So You Wanna Open a Dark Portal. <laughs> How conveniently specific. It sounds like exactly what we're looking for. Uh, I hope so. <gasps> hey, did we win? Hey, Dev and me won. <laughs> Rigged. <laughs> Sorry, everybody else. <laughs> okay, so the ads are going to start in like half um, half a minute, I was going to say. That's kind of rigged, yeah. Um, no wonder they've been popping up everywhere. Hmm, are you going to read? According to this, we need something called Dreamlight Prism to fix the portal. There's a bunch of broken glass on the floor over there. I bet they've forgotten to try this too. Okay. It says we need glass and purified night shards. So we need to craft something then, yeah? Well, there are some gems over there but near the portal, but not all the colours. Some must be missing. Don't worry. I'm sure we can figure out what to do. And finally, I need to whisper one of my darkest fears into the portal. But for now, I'll start by making the Dreamlight Prism. Okay, Hands so there we are. Down. This is the best day of my life. I'm going to pause it there then. Like I said, I'm going to go on my break. The ads have already started for those of you who get ads. I will be back in about three minutes. In the meantime, go grab a drink, go grab a snack, all those lovely things, and I will see you then. I'm back. Hello. How are we all doing? Did you all go get a snack and stuff? Signal dips when the pair gets back, so... Back is purple. No, it's pink. Um... That um, electricity and load shedding and stuff is a pain in it. Okay. <clears throat> uh, I'm struggling, but I'm good. I'm fine. I'm fine. Uh, let me get back into the game. There we go. So now we've spoken to him about the um, the memories and the forgotten and all that kind of stuff. You go to bed. No worries, Catherine. Thank you so much. Have a good weekend. I will see you not tuesday remember because i'm taking tuesday off next week but i'll see you back here thursday um in the meantime soft soul <laughs> in the meantime i'll see you on youtube catherine soft soul thank you so much for that term on three sub what the heck thank you thank you let me pop you a gem in there how have you been you're doing well the, you know what? The two-month resubs are always super special. 
to me because like somebody can sub once or they can get gifted a sub once and you're like it is what it is but the fact that you liked it so much that you came back for a second month is like ah love it ah. <laughs> thank you thank you thank you thank you okay what was i doing i forgot what i was doing oh yeah um we now need to gather 10 pieces of glass um three purified night shards and a shattered prism so yeah you're doing good hey nice so can we gather these pieces of shattered prism yeah one two and there's books everywhere as well so we should probably grab the the books because they do seem to be glowing so that's probably a reason to pick them up right uh where's the other ones here they are big hypes lots of big hypes can i check them can i open them conjure your cares away a simple do-it-yourself guide to conjuring whatever you need beginner's guide to transfiguration helpful instructions on how to turn a prince into a frog or a pumpkin into a carriage <gasps> oh hang on hang on is this in-game you burped but you're back again no worries welcome back are these in-game hints prince into a frog well that's naveen right and a pumpkin into a carriage that's fairy godmother a handy guide to curses and hexes from simple and subtle to truly twisted Ooh, can i read these no but can i can i do anything with these can i, I want to read this one it's just saying to drop it i want it i want to do something with it any more books before i go back to my crafting table i don't think that there are hmm you put them in the chest in your house yeah i think i'm gonna do that so yeah it said that we needed the right crystals for this the right color gems and i think like what i said earlier i think i was on the right path but we'll see when we get there so let's go home back to where my crafting table is i'll put them in a chest and we'll see if we can craft some glass and some purified night shards um back over here again You're still here, no worries, Kelly. Are you enjoying playing your game? Okay. Oh, should I water this dead flower, shouldn't I? Water that. There we go. How do you change the colours of your house? I love how they've changed the aesthetic of the chests as well. Because now you can um, change it. You can make bigger chests. There's my golden potato. So I'm going to put these in here. Transfer, transfer, transfer. And I've got all this other stuff I've got as well. God's sake. So much stuff everywhere um crafting table so we need glass a medium-sized chest and a large chest press f when outside the house and you click on the house at the bottom it says your place oh does it really oh cool what are you playing arty i'm glad that everyone's lurking and having fun times um we need glass for which we need sand do i not have enough sand I thought I had more sand than that. We'll have to go down to the beach and get some of that. And we also need purified night shards. Oh, look at these. Fishing training manual. Call of the wild, the angler. Oh. So the fishing training manual, we need different kinds of fish and tons and tons of dream light. Um, the foraging one is bananas, basil and blueberries. The mining one is topaz, peridot and aquamarine. The digging one is pebble, soil and sand. And the gardening one is corn, carrots, and tomatoes. So yeah, we just definitely need some more sand. How many of these did we need? I've forgotten. I've forgotten what it said. Uh, let me check. Quests. 10 glass, 5 night shards. 10 glass, 5 night shards. Um, 10 glass, 5 night shards. So 5 of those. Make. And... 10 glass for which we need five sand each so we need 50 sand you assume that you give those to the person you want to do the job yeah i believe so i think that's how it works but yeah i haven't i don't know i've not seen it done uh let me go to the beach i guess and uh, dig up some sand oh hang on a second though Hang on. Can we go up to... No, never mind. I was going to say, can we go up to the thingy, the plateau, and get some of those bones? Because that gives you sand as well, doesn't it? 
but we'll go down because we can open up those big coral things they give you loads of sand as well as just digging in the dirt like these things here crack these open why can't I, why can't i i've forgotten how to do it I for, oh is it like is it is it is it this there we go there we are Ooh, that's a lot of sand let me get the smaller ones as well sweet how much do we have how much do we have now um 11 oh that's not too bad we got like 11 shot away we needed 50 well 47 let's see there's some more corals further on the beach i think i hope yeah there's some over there i can see one a smaller one two smaller ones a bigger one would help um crack that one and i think you could buy sand as well i'm pretty sure that christoph was selling sand at his stall today but i don't have an awful lot of money so i don't want to just go spending it on stuff i can dig out the ground you know what i mean uh oh there's one over there that's a bigger one as well that should give us quite a few so many so many and any more how much do we have now um 25 okay almost half well we're just over halfway there now i can see another big one and some more little ones around here grab the digging buddy and dig the beach that's a good idea i'm gonna get all these big um these big corals first and then i'll do that that is a very good idea That's quite a lot. That's a nice amount of uh, sand there. Oh, there's another small one down there. I forgot who my digging buddies are. Apart from, I know that Mary is. I think that Scar is. I don't remember what I gave Stitch. Um, collections, characters. Um, Wally is a gardener. Merlin is a gardener. Stitch is a miner. Mary is digging. Now more is fishing. Wouldn't mining buddy be good for the coral? Um, I don't know. I don't know if it would. I know it gives you stuff when you hit the actual mining spots, the walls. I never tried them with the corals, to be fair. Um, Remy's gardening. Scar is digging. Is Eric gardening? Hmm. Oh, Anna's digging. Anna's digging. Um any of these guys digging no none of these guys either <gasps> look at mirabelle oh i just oh look at her there you can tell you've been slacking this game oh they just got the stitches third sock oh really you have a chest each of every building material which is a handy as you can do a quest straight away that's a lot of building materials then sarah you've been definitely stashing it away right if i can find anna and there's a digging guy or um maui maui's in his house let me go and get maui <clears throat> he's right here he's a pain to have around but he might be useful for this you're gonna go back to lurky lurks no worries pink thank you for being here hey maui Hey, 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 Maui. Hey, hey, Maui. Talk hey, to me. What took you so Good long? to see you. Can you please hang out with me? <laughs> I'm just kidding. And let me grab my shovel. Pop on for around an hour every day. Oh, nice. Can I just dig? Oh, no, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to plant it. I don't want to plant it. I just want to dig. But hopefully. Oh, money. Can we dig for sand? need to make a bunch of big chests to transfer everything yeah the chests look good i'm glad that we can do them it's a shame you can't just upgrade the ones you've got that would have been much better more quality of life you know what i mean rather than having to make bigger ones what can you do with the little ones there though you know now we've got a bunch of small chests if we make larger ones to replace them with what do we do with the smaller ones are they just gonna sit there can we like break them down for parts 
Um, sand? No, that's night shards. He's not giving me much sand, dude. There's some. Ah, ha ha ha. Here we go. Here's the sand. I didn't want the pebbles. Oh, my energy. Oh, man, I forgot about energy in this game. I completely forgot that energy was a thing. Yeah, a recycling thing would be good, right? Um, so in Stardew Valley, not as part of like the base game, but you need to... Well, it is part of the base game, but not as early on. You need to get it by doing quests. There's a, a machine, isn't there, that you can break things down into, and it breaks them back into the parts that you use to make it i think you lose some in the process but like it'll break it down into wood and stone and whatever so you get those back a little bit something like that would be good in this welcome back to earth um you have a routine in the morning you do the daily on the little to the left then you do dbd for three points then you do an error or so on dizzy dream light and then four guys dailies and then you're tired and you can lie down with your controller that's nice a nice little routine for gaming Okay. I didn't know that um, Little to the Left had dailies. I haven't played it. I played the demo when it first released in like Next Fest last year. But I haven't played like the full game. Let's go back to the beach. Get some more sand. It looks nice. It looks infuriating though, I have to say. I watched someone play it and parts of it look nice and relaxing and then parts of it you're like... Uh, what? Why can I not do this? It's in exactly the same place as it was before. And you're like, nah. You kind of wish they had a recycling machine. All your chests in your chest room turn into little chests. When you sort them out. Yeah, what are you going to do with the little chests after that then? You're going to have a chest full of chests? It's like having a bag of bags, isn't it? Everyone's got a bag of bags in their kitchen. You have a chest full of chests. I mean, I suppose you could do the little chests around. You know how you were saying you have a chest at, um, by each stall with the different flowers from the biomes? You could use the little chests for that, I guess. Just so you can drop things off without having to keep zooming all the way back home. Where, pray tell, is all the sand? Um, or your adult cord drawer. Yeah, your junk drawer in the kitchen with, like, random plugs that no one knows what they're for but you can't get rid of them in case you need it you know what if you find the thing that is the charger's for and then you don't have the charger anymore because you got rid of it what about that they're going oh they're just going to your inventory with other furniture oh that's good then that so doesn't take up space oh damn it mary where is all this sand I blame Mary like it's his fault. It's not. He's giving me double of everything that I'm digging up. He's doing his job. Game, where's my sand? I might not be able to do any more with this particular quest if I can't find the sand to make the glass. And then I'll wait till the next day for the coral to respawn. Oh, there's some sand. Nope, that's just money. That's just money. Come on, give me some sand. Like, I had loads. I think I used a lot of glass in the Christmas thing. When we were doing the Christmas crafting, I think I used a lot of sand up there. And that's how come I've only got three, because I did have a lot. I think I had like a full stack of it. Or at least close to a full stack. There's some more. There's some more. Hey, thank you for giving me the doubles. How much do we have now? Uh, oh, 59. Yes, that's enough. That is enough. Let's go. Let's go back to our crafting table. And let's make some glass. 10 items of glass. Okay. Use. Glass. Let's do 10. There we go. Sorted. Is that everything? Now what do I need to do? Craft the dreamlight prism. Okay. That is uh potions and enchantment. No. Functional items, there it is. And um, what annoyed you with all the dark wood chests, the connected ones, um, were turned to indoor only. You had one 
in every biome where you could dump things oh the garlic etc yeah 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 um but you for some reason the lightwood version works outside so you had to go and spend 20k plus to buy one of those oh no really they're all connected but can't be used as real chests oh no see i never got really into it like that so i never figured that out but man that sucks okay we'll make the prism now what do we do place it on the pedestal in the secret chamber okay well back up to here we go is it still foggy and blizzardy yes not as much where's the wall there it is here we go the pedestal this pedestal um here it is i was like where's the thing got it in here oh and then figure out which gems are missing in the secret chamber and replace them okay i think i know um let me go grab some gems and come back i think i'm gonna need a purple one an orange one and a green one because we've got red blue and yellow so i think we need the secondary colors let's go back to my house grab those also can we drop some stuff off because my inventory is getting quite full full of bits and pieces i'm going to get my gems from my gem room well my storage room okay so i can drop uh, can i like transfer smart transfer is that all there is in there okay and then do this one smart transfer nope this one smart transfer this is quicker this is much quicker move that one smart transfer oh that was good with the flowers that took quite a lot out that was good move some of these out this is so much faster and oh did i only get one of the festive fish i think i only got one of the festive anglers oh man that's not good um move that one across and move these across okay so I'm gonna just drag these down the bottom so they're out of the way a sec. And then I've got stuff at the top that I need, like this one. And I'm gonna use, um, we had red, we need amber. So I'm gonna do, okay, just do one of those, split, put those back. One orange, one, I don't know whether it's gonna be peridot or emerald. So I'll do split one of that and split one of that just in case it's a different green. There was a blue and then I'm pretty sure it's a purple. Split there. There we go. And then just in case it needs the larger ones, the shinies as opposed to the normal. Let me just go to my shiny chest over here and grab one of each of these out so orange there again peridot just in case it's the peridot emerald in case it's the emerald and then amethyst there we go so we've got regular and shiny of each of these in the secondary colors um you like the new way of wallpapering the rooms too oh really i haven't seen can you do one color of each like one wall of each color well, you like connected chests in each area so you can drop things in there and run home later. That's so good. Yeah, that would be really good. I hadn't thought to do that at all. But now you can't. <laughs> that sucks. But these things here, you mean? These are the connected ones. With all this stuff in. Transfer that across. Oh, that was so good. Did you see how fast that just went across? Oh, it's like the convenient chests mod in Stardew. You can... You can do them now, but only with the light wood version. Oh, okay. Um, what am I doing? Oh, yeah, we're going back to this wall here. And we're going to try these gems out. Let's see if I've got the right idea. See if my puzzling knowledge is useful. Where am I going? Which way do I go? Where, where's the wall? I'm lost. I'm lost. Oh, it's over here. There we go. There. 
you remember when we played Lonesome Village and there was a lot of those like mixing the colour light problems? Let's see. I'm going to interact and I'm going to put a normal one first. Oh, did not didn't go over? Oh, is it not going in? Do I need a shiny? Oh, no, it's... Ignore me. It's the purple one. It's purple. It's purple because it's red and blue. And then this one should be... Um, green. So is it that one? Or is it emerald? It's emerald. And then this one should be orange. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Colors work. Ooh. And then we can go through. Whisper one of your deepest fears into the flickering portal in the secret chamber. It's the infinity zones, <laughs> yeah. To get to the portals to stay stable, I need to tell it one of my deepest fears. Spiders, clowns, or being alone. Mm -hmm. You were scared that what you picked would show. I don't know how would they show being alone, though. Um, out of these three, probably spiders. Oh, the legs and the eyes are so creepy and crawly and... Hey, something's happening to the portal. I think the magic is starting to work. The same. I mean, being alone is quite terrifying, but, you know. <gasps> oh, I got his arms back! Oh, where is he? You saw spiders and the clans and was like, nope. You got Mirabelle? Awesome! I'll work on that after I've done this one, I think. Olaf's arms and an orb. Give. Aww. Oh, so glad you made it. You found my arms. What um, what thing are you gonna think of giving her? What role do you think you'll give her? I mean, obviously you can't do that until she's level two, right? But have you decided on what you're gonna give her? Hey, hey! that's much better. I feel so sticky. Because they're sticks. Yeah, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh -huh. I thought you'd like it. Well, I didn't just find drums. I also found the orb. There's only one problem. It seems to be broken. Huh? Gasp! What's wrong with it? The light inside's gone out. The magic is just gone. I don't think this is going to be enough to fix the pillar and stop the blizzard. Oh, no. I'm sorry, Jenny. I wish I knew how to fix it. Uh, There must be a way. There must be. You just have to figure out the mystery. Maybe there's a book in Merlin's library or another memory somewhere. Or maybe I may not know how to fix it, but I do know one thing that can make everything better. A warm hug. Now I can have my arms again and I can give you one. Aww. You like her already? Yeah, I'm so excited to get her. Oh, 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 he's magical now. Oh, the magic of friendship. What did we do? Why is he glowing? Uh, I feel a lot better now. Warm hugs are the best. Wait a second. The orb started to glow when you hugged me. Merlin said he didn't know what virtue powered the pillar in the Fasted Heights, but now I know. It must be... Yay! Warm hugs? No. Uh, not exactly. It's love, Olaf. A simple act of love oh. fixed the orb. Ah, oh, then I guess I did know how to fix the orb after all. <laughs> Does this mean we saved the day? Almost, but not quite. I still need to put the orb back in the pillar. Let's go. Eh, uh, ooh. It's a little symbol inside of it. That's Atlantean. Let's go and put it back in. And hopefully this will get rid of the blizzard, right? So we can actually see again. Interact. Pillar. Orb. Let's go. cleared the air i can actually see again now nice talk to olaf oh, do i have to keep going back in here and back out and back in and back out all the time can you just come out to me and that's completed hello wow jenny you found my missing piece and not the blizzard you're very talented there's still lots of questions left though like what was the deal with the secret chamber what is the forgotten doing in there don't worry jenny i know you'll figure it out you're practically the official village figure 
Outer Outerer. I'll be here if you need any warm hugs or words of sage wisdom from a snowman wise beyond his years. But for now, I'm going to see what's changed in the village while I was winning at hide and seek. I think you're going to love it, Ola. Uh, there's lots of new villagers to befriend. Really? I can't wait to meet them all. Thank you for finding me. You're the best seeker a hider could have. Aww. One more thing. Tag, you're it. Oh, bless him. Level two. Nice. Oh, let's look at the things we can get with him. Ooh, so we can get the snow globe. That looks like a, a motif. Or is it real, like, actual snow globe? That's a motif. Queens. Look at the little, oh, snogies. Because it's like a bogey when Elsa sneezed, but it, they're little snowmen, so it's a snogey. That's another motif. That's money. That's a little jumper. And then that's a motif. And then what is this? Is that like a motif, do you reckon? Or is it like an actual floating piece of furniture? Hmm. Oh, and he's got us like a friendship quest as well. Oh, what do I give him? Um, hey, Delta Dawn, huh? You hope it's a hat? Oh, that's fun. Yeah. Because in the in the film, doesn't he have it like above his head? And it like sprinkles on him his own personal flurry. Welcome in, by the way. How are you doing? Um, what should I give him? Uh, um, I mean, it's not that super important because I can change it now. You've adulted, now you can play. Yes. Join us. Join us, Pink. I'm going to give him digging. I don't have a lot of digging buddies. You're giving him the first one for now. Yeah, because you can change it, can't you now? Now we've got the, the new update with the books. We can change it if you want to. Gardening for the carrots. I have a lot of gardeners, though. I already have a lot of gardeners. Hi, it's me. Ola. Um, I was going to come find you. I'm very happy to be back in the village, but oddly, it doesn't mm -hmm. feel right. It's like something's missing. I just don't know <sighs> what. You're older and thus all-knowing. Could you help me out? Everything is better when you're older. I'll try. <sighs> Tell me more. Well, this place used to be full of joy and friendship and warm hugs, but some of the villagers don't seem happy at all. Like the grumpy lion and the lady who's always looking in the mirror. Grumpy lion and lady looking in the mirror? Well, that's Scar and Mother Gothel, yeah. Um, you can't make everyone happy. It's not your place to, you know. Don't stress yourself out. Um, they're hungry for power. If they were happy, a lot of other people in the village wouldn't be. Wow, so you're saying that some conceptions of happiness are at odds with others and maximizing the happiness of everyone is practically impossible? Yes. <laughs> Very grown up thought. Let's keep it simple. What have you tried doing to make Scar and Mother Gothel happy so far? Well, I tried to give Scar a warm hug. Yeah, he's, mm, but my permafrost got stuck in his fur and he didn't like it. And then I tried telling Mother Gothel some fascinating trivia, like, like, what did you tell her? I told her that the average human breathes in and out 22,000 times a day. She didn't seem to be impressed. Maybe we could give them some gifts. That always cheers people up. This is like Stardew, in it? Like, you win friendship with gifted people <laughs> all the time. Here, love me. Have a thing. What an incredible idea. I knew... You could help me, Jenny. You have an innate wisdom that comes with maturity, and I know just what to get them. Let's start with some flowers. Um, red bromeliads, blue passion lilies, and white passion lilies would make an exquisite bonnet. Red, white, and blue? Oh, okay. And of course, some salmon. Salmon? Why? Just trust me on this one. It's all going to make a wonderful gift. Why don't you go find everything while I figure out what to write in the cards? Dear Scar. Next one. Dear Mother Gothel. Uh, no, to my most esteemed fellow villager. Oh, oh dear me. <sighs> this makes... Okay. <gasps> hey, thank you, Yupi. Thank you for the stretch. Thank you. Ooh. Um, let's, um... We could do this one. We need all these. However, I want to go and talk about getting to see Mirabelle. So we'll track this one instead. We need to go return to Merlin and talk about that golden doorknob. Let's go. Find where he is. He was in the middle of the plaza but where is he now uh oh he's down here yeah he's in scrooges oh i was gonna go into scrooges wasn't i uh we'll go in scrooges and have a look and scrooge looks like he needs to talk to me as well he had a purple thing on him Ooh, ooh, nice dress oh 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 it's just me or is it different wallpaper in here? It might just be me. I haven't been in for a while. Hey, Scrooge. 
What's up? Yeah, the moment of the game. <laughs> Oh, Jenny, I'm afraid the Frosted Heights have never drawn many visitors. They're colder than the Yukon. Uh -huh. Of course, if you could make that forbidding frosty place a little more warm and inviting, I'll make it the perfect place for enjoying a cup of hot cocoa. I nobody to turn a piece of real estate like you, Jenny. Oh, yeah, I was, you have to put like 10 pieces of furniture down, and I was just putting 10 pieces of like flooring down because that's usually fine. Yeah, that usually works fine collection let's go and see we've got him look at him oh oh his favorite things today are sand plus he would be sand wouldn't it um tourmaline and blue passion lily that's fine uh where's merlin there he is hi oh hello let's see how the golden dawn have reacted to your acts of kindness i love how his canes are candy cane now aha excellent work jenny we're getting closer but we still need more dream light what can i do the best way to create more is simply to take care of the village if you need a reminder of what you can do don't forget to gaze into the waters of the plaza well um can you move the trees and stuff to make that count does that count like if you just move them to one place to another even if they were already there does that count or just move them from somewhere else um i'll go do that and check with you later off with you now also what is this do you want to give these items a give? Okay. Well, hello. Your hard work has paid off. It does. Ooh. Mini Casita is now ready to return to the valley. You simply must decide where you wish for Mirabel to live and it will appear. Oh, where to where do I put her? Where do I put her? Also, we got something then. What did we get? Is it just her house? Oh no, it's a snow globe. Oh, it is a frozen thing. Ah. Also, do we have like... Do we have um, an Encanto furniture set? Oh, we do, but there's nothing in it yet. There's going to be 13 things in it, apparently. And a Princess of the Frog! Mm. I'm just seeing this. I'm very late to the party here. Princess and the Frog. In the furniture sets. Ah. <gasps> Oh my goodness. Okay, is clothing sets? Is there a Princess and the Frog in clothing sets? So we've got Sword in the Stone, Wally, Dreamlight Valley, Moana, Ratatouille, Beauty and the Beast, Wreck It Ralph, Cinderella, Lion King, Little Mermaid, Frozen, Tangled, Monsters Inc., Toy Story, Lilo in Stitch, the little hat, Incredibles, Coco, Cars, Lightyear, Encanto, and General. So no Princess and the Frog clothing, but 13 um, furniture items? Well, well, oh, uh, I don't know. Where did everybody put their mini casita? I've no idea where to put it. Where looks the most like, um, Colombia? You know, everywhere's looking a little bit crowded, to be honest. Um, F. Um, oh, look at it. Oh, it's massive. What the heck? It's huge. Oh, my God. Um, where where you put yours in the sunlit plateau on the other side oh that's not a bad idea you mean like over over here by um the lion king stuff it's massive uh, i might put it up here can i put it can i put it here will it go here can i can i i want to put it down somewhere welcome back jord you put it next to the bridge I already have houses by the bridge. I have Eric's castle here. I mean, and there's this pond there. It's just so, it's just so big. I don't know where to put it. <laughs> mini my boy, right? This is not mini. This is huge. Um, why can't I put it down here? What's blocking it? What's blocking you here? You thought the Sunday plateau for the colours fit better? Yeah, I agree. The colours look nice. Can I ro mm, rotate the item? Oh, look, it's really pretty, though. I need to do move some things about, don't I? Hold on. Can I cancel that? Can I move some of this stuff about? Move this tree. Can I move this rock over here? Can I move this tree down here? Can I move this bromeliad? 
No, will it fit here? Hey, that fits. That's massive. That, that's huge. Am I going to have to pay like 10 grand to put it there? Um, escape. 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 Is it? <gasps> Welcome, Mirabelle. Okay, okay, okay. No charge for once. That's nice. Normally it's 10 grand in it for each house. <gasps> Look at her. Oh, I love her skirt. Her dress looks amazing. Maui, nobody asked you to be in the picture. Maui, put your arms away. What's going on? <laughs> I love it. Oh, I have something to tell you. <gasps> Is that her voice as well? So good to see you. Oh, where am I? How long have I been asleep? Wait, am I back in the valley? It looks so much better. Look at her doing a little dance. I love her. So I made all the darkness go away. She's amazing. You must be the one who did that. Feliciades. Um, I'm so glad to be back. Does she throw in random Spanish words? Because I love that. Hmm. Where were you? I'm not sure. It was strange and everything looked frozen in time. I woke up once to drink a glass of water, but I was so tired I went straight back to bed. I'm guessing you're the one I should thank for bringing me back. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> and Mary's right there. <laughs> you're welcome. Something tells me we're going to be great neighbours. Woo! I'm so happy to see the village. Oh, look at her doing a little dance. <laughs> Just gave the mining book to Scrooge and it's changed him. He's level 10 though, so I'm not sure if it works on lower levels. I think I read in the patch notes that it would only work on level 10, but I might have misinterpreted that. Um, before the forgetting, it was full of friends, happiness, and so much laughter. Everyone helped each other just like they did in my encanto. I really loved it here. Mm. That's why I was so sad to see people forget and leave, and then when the darkness fell over everything. Huh. But now the darkness oh. is gone. There's dreamlight shining on everything again, and I'm back. I can already huh. tell you're doing amazing stuff here, and I can't wait to see what happens next. Yay! We, definitely have to again. we did it! Okay, that's characters. There she is. She's going to be right at the very bottom. There she is. That's you understood as well. Yeah, that, that's what I um, interpreted it as. So she needs fruit salad, fish tacos, or orange star lilies. Ooh, the volcano. Nice. Does she have a quest for us? Hmm. I need to level her up to level two. We can do that by talking to her and maybe giving her a gift. Um, but also, now we've done that, what was this one? Craft a blue and silver balloon arch for that old one that we were doing. Can I do that? Blue and silver balloon arch. Just need one of those. Uh, furniture? Is it under here? There's the cluster. Where's the arch? It's probably... Here it is. What did I need for? Oh, I was missing a lot of blue flowers. So blue star lilies and blue marsh milkweed. Um, did I get Olaf? Yes, we did. Yeah, we have Olaf now. We have Olaf and we have um, Mirabelle now. Should have a new companion. Um, oh, should we? Is he is he a companion now? Collections. Um, no. Where's where's the compa companions? Companions. Where's companions? I've forgotten where companions is. Furniture, no. No. Where, where, where? Oh, 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 hang on, hang on. Wardrobe. Companions, there it is, there it is. Clothing, yeah, I was like, where is it now? Um. Hello? Oh, the scary squirrel! Oh, yes. Okay, so that one's definitely following me about now. Sorry, Festive Fox. Um, we're gonna go with the, the spooky squirrel. Very nice. And get rid of all of these. Oh, poor. Okay. You're going to follow me around now. It makes little, like, creepy laugh noises. Ugh. Okay, so blue marsh milkweed. That's the glade, right? Poor is the cutest. I think it's really funny that of all the other images, they're, like, the 3D renders from the game, and then the poor one is quite obviously, like, just cut from a, a movie image it's like been cut out in photoshop and all the rest are just the 3d renders 
rather than actually being a, a 3D render of the character in the game. It's just photoshopped. Um, let's go. I when I got Pua, I did have him as a companion for the longest time. Right, let's go see. Um, blue marshmallow queen. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure that the blue one looks white on the ground. Yeah, that one's the purple one. Some of them look a weird colour because of the lighting. This girl goes so good with your outfit because you got all the thorn and dark stuff. Oh yeah, I rocked that outfit for a while. Around um, Halloween time. I was very much enjoying that villain's look. Yeah, this one here. Is this the blue one? Is that blue? That's the white one. So the white one looks blue. So where's the blue one? Hello. Flowers. That's why I didn't finish that Buzz Lightyear one because it was taking ages. I'm having to keep coming back in and doing it. That That's the blue one. How's the difference? What do they look different? One's kind of a light blue and one's like a blue blue. That's a white one, isn't it? Yeah, that one looks white. That's purple. Um, I might as well get them while I can. Uh, that's also purple. Anything else around here before I cross the bridge? No. Once I've got some of these flowers, I think I'll check the um, the star path and see if we can do any of the star path stuff. There's blue. That's the orange one. Anything on this side? I don't think so. What are all these? I forgot what I planted. And also, we need to do some carrots, don't we? Where do I find star lilies? Because these are the milkweed. If I come this side, quests. Um, no. Collections, flowers. Origin? Origin? Yes, here we go. Um, blue star. Where are what? Wait, 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 wait. The blue solid, there it is. The forest. Oh, yeah, forest of valor. Thank you, Sarah. Um, we'll go and get some of those and see what we can find. If I can get comfy. <coughs> Let's go. Forest of valor. Zoom all the way across. Hi, little raccoon. That's a bellflower. You only just, as you, oh, you know, because you only just picked one up. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I appreciate it. So that's a bellflower. I don't need that one. Star lily, star lily, star lily. That's garlic. That's, oh, I need some of these. That's one. Is that the blue one? Is that the blue one? That's the blue one. That's what I meant. That's the blue one that looks white. And then there's a white one that looks blue. It's just, they're all over the place. Hi, Krista. How we doing? Ninja, did you get those head pads? Look at you go. Got this yellow one. These are all bell flowers. I don't need the bell flowers. I'll leave those for now. Hey, some more thorns. Nice. You're getting seeds from the thorns today. You most certainly did. Nice. Good catch. Good catch. Is that the blue one? Or is it actually a white one? Jenna, hi, good morning. Welcome in. How are you doing? We're just checking out the new update in um, Disney Dreamlight Valley today. And we've got Olaf and we've got Mirabelle. Nice and early, but I've got some quests to do. And we're having a look at the star path as well. You didn't finish the last page of the star path? <gasps> quick, quick, open your game, Jordan, open it. Get in there, get it done. Um, right. There's some more bell flowers. I don't need those. I wish I need, you know what I need? Can I, is there a crafting table inside, um, Christoph's house? There isn't, is there? They have a cooking, they have a kitchen, but they don't have a crafting table. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh, what is this? What do I have? There's this in here, apparently. But there is. That's weird. That's weird. 
we need to go up to the frozen heights frosted heights even and move some stuff around so that that thing for scrooge is completed and look what well, you just said that we can move things around and it still counts as placing new items because if that counts then uh that's exactly what i'm gonna do so if we go like one move it you had some weird dreams and woke up at 6 48 you might fall back asleep but you really wanted ice cream i mean have yourself some ice cream if you want some ice cream but yeah take care of yourself get some sleep if you need some sleep you place 10 items in spot to scrooge and then remove them again i normally do like 10 pieces of path does that count now i've moved some stuff around you don't have any oh no um where's the quest there is yeah it counted place eight pieces of furniture down <laughs> i'm literally just moving the trees around i'm not actually placing anything new it's just like mm, place that in there that's one and then there's two done <laughs> that should be done right so your dessert of choice lately ice cream and bananas really um we'll go back and talk to scrooge wherever scrooge may be is he in his shop uh yes you finished setting up your new phone now just need to wait for your old number to be moved over to your new one hey you need one more item on page four so question for you all um do you are you the kind of pe people who um will complete one full path one full page on the path before moving on to the next page or do you just get the bits that you like off the one before it unlocks the second page and then the third page and then go back and get the ones in the beginning later on when you've got enough um coins for them because when we did the first star path the pixar one i did a complete page first and then a complete page and then another complete page um but with the halloween one because i knew that i was going to be away on holiday and i didn't know if i'd be able to complete it i did the get all the clothing and furniture and all the important things first and then go back and got the um the moonstone stuff last you finish the first page yeah you claim page by page because you know you will complete it yes i mean to be fair it does seem pretty easy to complete doesn't it <clears throat> Let's go talk to Scrooge and then we'll have a look at our star path and see how we're getting on with it. Uh, Scrooge, there he is. Hey, Merlin. Hey, Scrooge. Oh, greetings, Plus the tights are a spot even I can relax in. Yeah, there's literally Guess nothing different there, but I'll okay. Oh, that's a nice table. I think I have this rug and I'm, I think I might have those lights. Oh, is this for Olaf? Oh, it's from Lilo and Stitch. Sunset parasol and green towel. That's nice. It's 4,000 though. That's, I mean, I don't have a lot of money in this game. I've got 41,000, which I know is, it feels like a lot, but it's not, is it? For those of you who play the game a lot, 41,000 is not a lot. Look at this big wardrobe. That's a nice chair. Ooh, okay. There's some nice things in here, but nothing I really, really want him. It has to take at least five days as one quest is to start daily discussions with a certain character five times. Oh, fair enough. You have 18 million. Damn, Zara. Like I said, I haven't been coming in and doing the dailies. I haven't been coming in and getting like the pumpkin money and all that like I used to. Right, events. We've done 22 out of 30 night thorns. I think we might have got them though. You can do two discussions a day. Yes, you can. Um, mine garnets. Hang out with Mickey for another 30 minutes or so. Pumpkins, pack pumpkins and get an extra gardening buddy to help the extra. Yes. Um, daily discussions, we need eight. You know what? Can I grab anything with the hundred that I've got? I can. I like these. I like these. I like all of these. I'm going to get this first. I tend to go like most expensive first then I know I've got it get the rabbit oh i'm not gonna use it though i'm gonna keep using the scary squirrel squirrel um now i have 50 left so i'm gonna get the poster that's nice um they changed it at the christmas update yeah they did 
you got that rabbit following you around. I think if I hadn't got the the scary squirrel, I would have gone for the rabbit, but I like the squirrel. Um, and I've got 20, so I can get these two, and I can leave that one. I can get these motifs. Look at my Donald. Look at the, oh, what do they call it? Iridescence. I think that's what they were calling it when we were in, in Florida. Anything with like the, this like shimmery stuff on it, it's iridescent, like Mickey ears. You've got the rabbit and the squirrel. Yeah, but which one do you have following you around? Because you can only have one at a time following you around, can't you? And I'll get this one, and then that is all of my extra 100 that they gave me. Let's see if we can get these. Uh, duties. We'll do 60 carrots. I can grow 60 carrots. Where's Mickey? Oh, you have none following at the moment? Okay. Where's my gardening pal? In fact, no, gardening pals don't help you when it comes to growing stuff, do they? Only when it comes to harvesting. So I will keep Mary with me a second while I dig the plots. And where do I buy... Oh, God, where do I buy carrots from? It's on the meadow, isn't it? Hey, you got the rabbit yesterday and it's following you around. How you doing, Jericho? Welcome on in. I might switch it out for the rabbit later, but for now, I quite like having this little weird squirrel with me. Right, carrot seeds. Do I have any carrot seeds at home? Before I buy some, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I know I had some seeds with me. I've got one. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'll just buy 60 seeds from here then. Um, browse. Oh, there's going to be a second ad break. It's going to be started in about two and a half minutes or so. Um, we will buy 60 of these. Hold that down. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for that. Uh, grab 60 of those. There we go. 600. That's cheap. That's fairly cheap. Okay, so when I go on my break, um, it'll be three minutes worth of ads. Um, but you won't miss anything on gameplay because I'll be going for a, a break myself. But then we'll be ad-free for the rest of the stream then after that. So that's pretty good for the next hour. Let's dig some spots for these carrots, shall we? Where can I dig them? Here? Is here a good place? There we go. Are you going to help me, Maui? Are you are going to get in the way though, aren't you? No, 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 don't you dare, don't you dare. Um, no, 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 wrong button, wrong button. This tree is going to get in my way. One, two, three, four, five, uh, six. Six, seven, eight, uh, nine, and ten. And if I do like six, six rows, then that's the sixty in it. And they take quite a short time to grow, don't they? Carrots, not like pumpkins, which is like four hours. You have to water them and everything. Move out the way, Mary. Move out, the, move it, Mary. Move out the way. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, don't redig it. I hate that. Let's keep going. Can I move this piece of rock thing here? Was that going to be in my way? Probably going to be in my way. There's the money. One. That's 20 done. And then we can get all these planted all in one go. I think I'm done with the night term thorns for the day. I couldn't see any more about. You can hold the dig button to dig continuously. Can you? Can you do that? On mouse as well? Just dig in one straight line? It does. It does indeed. I'd forgotten. This is the thing for not playing it for months, literally since Christmas. Before Christmas, even. Same with harvesting and planting. Oh, can you? I know you could with um, with harvesting and planting. I didn't know you could with digging as well. Nice. Go, 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 go. One, two, three, four, five. We've got to do one more row after this. Actually, the ads have already started, haven't they? So. And my energy's getting low. Yeah, my energy's low. So I'm going to pause it there. 
I'm going to take my break while the ads are on and my energy's low. BRB, back in a few minutes. I'll see you then. Go take care of yourselves. Hi, I'm back. That was a quick three minutes. Just had to touch up my shoulder and... Uh, no, she said there wasn't any music playing, so I've just paused that there, there. <laughs> to put some music on for you. Back into the game. Let me um, clear this red dot because I hate it. I hate it when there's little red notification dots on there. Okay, so what was I doing? Harvesting, I was doing the carrots, wasn't I? So we'll, we'll go back home. We'll get my energy back. You know what I haven't done yet as well? And I'm, while we're up by the house, I want to go and have a look in the castle and see if there's a new realm or anything and see what's going on in there right energy's up because i haven't looked at that yet i know that they were supposed to be getting something lion king based so let me go and see so what do we have now we have got three is it three realms the three at the start <gasps> is that it up there oh, 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 oh. oh no there's, there's four four sorry there's frozen and then there's toy story and then Lion King is coming in April. Oh, is it? Ah, uh, I see, I see, I see. Yeah, there's still nothing new on, up here, is there? I'm, I'm gonna guess it's been gonna be on here. It's probably gonna be this one, right? Next to the Frozen ones. So we got Frozen and Toy Story. And then there. Because then we got the three down the bottom and then three above it. Rather than just putting it randomly on the side somewhere. That makes sense. Realms seem to be every other update. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Right. We need to go back and plant those carrot seeds. Keep digging. Oh, oh, oh. Actually, actually, actually. While I'm here. A lot of this is... Oh, while I'm here. Let me... Do I have enough flowers? Or how short am I on flowers? For this balloon arch. Um, Three more blue star lilies. And quite a few more blue marshmallow weeds. I've got so few of those. They're really rare. So that's going to take ages. So in the meantime, let me switch my quests to this one. So I know to find it. Blue passion lilies, white passion lilies, red bromeliad, and three salmon. But in the meantime, we'll go and do the uh, carrots. Because then bromeliads are up on the plateau. The passion lilies are... You know what, though? I've just harvested all those blooming passion lilies, haven't I? From the frozen... From the frosted realms thing. Frosted heights. I've just gone and picked them all this morning. It's going to take a while for them to spawn back in, isn't it? Damn it. Right, what's it doing? Dig there. That's going to be... Five rows. And then we'll do... Another, another row, that'll be six. And then that's gonna bug me because of that rock, but hey, what are you gonna do? <laughs> we go this one. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, that was um, some dream light. Hey, grab that. Come on, keep going. And uh, almost there. I've got one more to help dig because that space is full. It's not gonna be even, which is praying although i can just do this and move it can't i i'm gonna just go like that and move it <laughs> just move it quickly out of the way i need to have my garden nice in the straight line and then we'll uh we'll plant the carrots and i could just hold these down i wish that you got gardening xp from planting and watering and not just harvesting but you don't it's just the one star same as everybody else Oh, actually, actually, stop, 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 stop. Where is Mirabelle? Where's Mirabelle? Because if I can be getting some random friendship points with her, even if it's not the thing that she can do, then I will. Is she in here? Is she in here? Hi, Violet. How are you doing? Where's Hacky Hacky's Mirabelle? Oh, she's in her house. She's in her house. Okay. Let's go find Mirabelle. Let's go grab her. And then even though I'm not doing anything specific, she can be getting those. I'm good. Thank you. Also, I would love to have a look inside Casita. Do a grab her. 
Look at the house. Look at it. Oh. Oh. It moves. It moves to the pink room. That is Isabel's. And then that green tower at the top, that's our whalers. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love it. Oh, it's so good. Okay, let's go inside and have a look. <coughs> oh, it's just her tiny nursery. Oh, kind of remind me of Sister Luisa, who works incredibly hard. Hey. So glad you're here. Buenos dias. Cool, oh, it's turn, Mirabel. Um, can I huh. ask you to hang out with me? Um, do you have any sisters? No, I'm an only child. Uh, really? Wow, with a family as large as mine, that takes a lot for me to imagine. To be fair, she's only got two siblings. Hola. She's got a big family, but she's only got two siblings. Just because I'm an only child doesn't mean I haven't got a big family. I've got tons of cousins, okay? Tons of cousins and aunts and uncles. How's it going? Um, I have something to give you. Orange star lily? I do have an orange star lily, actually. Yes, now she's level three. Gracias. <gasps> Look at the things. Oh, so you get glasses for the first bit. Then you get this is a, a motif, then money. And then this is like an art pot, the crafts and stuff. That is the cutest little capybara I've ever seen in my entire life. Some more money. And then is that, is that like a bench? And then that's a motif. And then look at these ponchos and skirts. That's cool. That level 10 friendship one is very cool. Okay. She can be a gardener. She can be a gardener. I, I have a lot of gardeners, hey, but she can be a gardener. Hi. So can you come and hang out with me, please? Um, oh, you have something to happen with Mini Casita? What's the issue? Nothing major, but there's some damage from the time we spent wherever it took me to protect me. Of course I'll help. Great, let's go to the mini casita. It'll be easy to show you. We, we're already there. We're, we're already there. Talk to me, Rebel. There you go. You have five older brothers and sisters, but no cousins because your dad was an only child and your mom was the only one from her family to have kids. You know what? That's really similar to my husband's family. Um... Apart from the brothers and sisters. So I am an only child, but I have tons of cousins. Whereas my husband, his dad's an only child and his mom is like one of two and she was the only one to have kids. So he has no cousins at all, but he has a sister. And it's weird to me that he has no cousins. Like, did you not like have just like extended family like my mom is one of seven and my dad is one of three and practically everybody in our families has had at least one child some of them have got more like my auntie has five kids so i have like five cousins and then my other my uncle has three kids and then <laughs> it's just loads of us we're everywhere uh see the floor and the walls are pretty messed up uh what did it look like before the floor was painted and the walls were bright and colourful. Now they're just kind of blah. I want to fix them and repaint them in greens and yellows. Where do you think we should start? Let's start with the basics. We need some materials such as softwood and stone to replace the damaged ones. As for the pigments, I'm thinking dandelion, jello daisies and green rising palestimates. I can get all that for you. That'd be amazing. Thank you. I'll start thinking about new patterns and going to paint and get things ready in here we definitely oh no your super power super went out thank you for the stretch pink how are you doing did you manage to get your power back we need loads of stuff for her lucky i love how you can kind of like see out but also like not quite a little bit i wonder what the music's like in here when you haven't got streamer mode on i'm gonna have to come back and listen to it later it sounds so like I'll say. I wonder if it's the the welcome to the family madrigal kind of in the background. Run away. Okay, so let's check out. We got the glasses. We got the glasses for her. 
they're they're here one out of two. Oh, they're all gonna be some encanto clothing yes two encanto clothing so we've got the glasses and then i'm assuming it's like the poncho or the skirt i don't know why you wouldn't get both but anyway uh what was i doing exactly what what what, what was i doing what was i doing you're back for 20 minutes now they're sending out a technician to see what it's off again oh i feel so like frustrated for you basically with your energy issues um this one i'm gonna track the this one because this looks like it's less this is a lot less to deal with bromeliad there's one like right there there we go four red bromeliads it's got to be about the place um there's none back here because that's right against the wall uh that's a a lily thing uh ooh, ooh. oh i thought it was gonna crash then <gasps> I hope it doesn't take seven hours like last Friday. Oh my god, seven hours? Are you kidding me? Does everybody where you're from is having like um, a generator quite regular, like normal to have? Because like, what if you need the power for something? What if you need the power to work from home or like for medical equipment? Do they provide you with a generator or do you have to like take care of that yourself? It just seems sucky. Right, there's some more bromeliads um white passion lilies and blue passion lilies i think the passion lilies are up in oh oh these need watering let's come back here i didn't water them in did i silly me i planted them but didn't water them in um in fact i didn't finish planting them because i was gonna get mirabelle i remember now i was gonna get mirabelle wasn't i to come and hang out with me and uh help with the gardening but then i forgot to ask her to hang out where is she now where did she go where did she go mirabelle i think she was in her house now she's not in her house mirabelle where is she she's not on the beach she's not in that house she's not up here she's not here it's starting to be, but people can't really afford it. I imagine. Where the heck is Mirabelle? Um, because that's what I was gonna do, isn't it? I was gonna take her down and have her be there while I planted the things, so she could get the extra points. I remember now. Um, Mirabelle. She's not. She's not there. She's definitely not there. She's not in Remy's. She's not in Scrooge's. She's not here. She's not there. She's not down here. Where did she disappear to? Um. Anybody ever lost a person before? I'm going to see if she's in her house. Or is it because I can't... No, it can't be because you can't hang out with her because... You can see Ursula and you can see Ariel on the map. I love how the house moves to greet you as you get closer. Oh, There she is. Can you come and hang so out with me? Hola. Oh, I can't have her hang out with me until I've fixed her house. Oh, no. Okay. Did it get to level two? Yeah, I think she's level three. Yeah, she's level three. But I'm guessing because this is her like initial quest. I can't do anything until I've done it. Adios. Adios. <laughs> no, not you. Not you. Not you. Not you. Not you. Not you. You had the same thing. Yeah. That's weird. Anyway, I will come back and do the the carrot seeds in a little bit because I do really want her to be there to help me. So in the meantime, we'll get some other things done. Let me see. White passionately, blue passionately. Like I said, I think I might have already got all these. That's a green one. That's a green one over there. That's a red one and a black one and another green one. Well, there's a blue one. That's blue. And then, oh, there's a white one. Any more white ones? I did pick up a ton of white ones earlier. I think I may have shot myself in the foot. There's two. Come on, please. Just, just two more. Two more is all I need. There's another one. One more, come on. We got this. One more white flower, that's all. One more. And it's not gonna be there, is it? It's not gonna be there. 
Oh, is that one over there? <gasps> That's one over there. There it is. <laughs> Where do I catch salmon from? Salmon. Let me check in my, not in my inventory, in my collections. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, where are my collections? Uh, foraging. Um, white. Uh, white passion lilies. No, not white passion. Fish. Sorry, fish. Fish. Salmon. Um, salmon is in the sunlit plateau or the frosted heights. Oh, okay. So I can catch them from up here then. Um, not that one. That one. There we go. Number four. Salmon. Where can I fish from? Let's try here. I can't remember how rare salmon is. Catch it. Oh, which no, sorry. I'm gonna need to have three. Now I've not fished in this game for a while, so can I remember how to do it? Hey, salmon! Nice! <laughs> Two more. Oh, there's a blue bubble, so they'll be more rare. And there's some white bubbles down there as well. Let's catch the blue bubbles. That, that won't be sturgeon, will it? That's a gold one in it for sturgeon. One, two, and three. Oh no, it is salmon. Are we just gonna catch them really easy because they're needed for a quest? That would be nice. Oops, no, that's not in the thing. There. Is that in the bubbles? I can't tell. One. Another salmon. Sweet. Okay. Uh, where is Olaf? He is in that building over there, I guess. Nope. No, he's not. He's down here. He's in Kristoff's house. I guess he lives there now. Which would make sense. Because he lives with Anna. Although, wouldn't he live with Elsa? In her cave of wonders. Um, Olaf. There you are. Why are they in the walls? Uh, give you all these, okay. Take all my flowers that I've just hard earned. Oh, I wish you could grow the flowers. Like if you had flower seeds. Oh, that'd be so good. You did it. You found the salmon and all the flowers. Hey, did you know together salmon and flower are an anagram of fall more snow? I did not know that. <laughs> Literally, who would know that? <laughs> That's okay. I find most people don't. <laughs> Come on, let's go give Mother Gothel her gift. I think she's gonna love it. See you soon. Uh, all of us with Anna in the movies. Yeah, she he is. That makes sense. Um, watch Olaf give the gift to Mother Gothel. Where is Mother Gothel? Is she down at her house? Mother Gothel, she is. Oh, she's on her way. Oh no, have I lost him? Have I lost him? Olaf, where did you go? Olaf? Oh, he's running, he's running, he's running, he's running. I always find this really funny. When the characters are going to meet each other and you've got to be there to see their conversation and they just peg it across the map and you've got to try and catch up with them. Where is he? Where did he go? <laughs> what? Hey, does Mary get through the door? I find it best not to question how Mary does lots of things. Come on, where, 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 where are, where are they? Where are they? Oh, they're, they're, they're there. Do I need to witness this conversation? Where did they go? Oh, there they are. They're, oh, I can't get round that way. I can't get round that way. No. Witness the conversation. Oh, they're talking. Here we go. Shh. Hello, Mother Gothel. We've got a very special gift for you. Okay. Salmon and flowers. I don't know if she'll like it. I really don't think she'll like fish and flowers. Raw fish? Why would you possibly want to give me raw fish? I don't know. Maybe then you can cook it. I don't know. Because I thought you'd like them. Oh, don't be mean to him. Did you know that salmon change colour and have... An excellent sense of smell. I, I did know that, yeah. Did the Gothel know that? How nice for them. Now, run along and stop pestering me with useless nonsense. She's so mean. 
I'm so surprised that my gift didn't make Mother Gotha happy. I mean, I'm not surprised, to be fair. I'm not surprised that she's not a big fan of raw fish and flowers. But also, don't just be mean to him. I thought that you were going to give her the flowers and scar the salmon. I think I got other things a little mixed up. Yeah, making everyone in the village is going to be harder than I thought. We have to keep trying. You're right, and we start by delivering this bouquet to Scar. Oh, we didn't give the flowers to her, just the fish. Oh, yeah, he got it sideways then, didn't he? We'll start by delivering that to her. I'm sure he will... Yeah, I don't know if Scar will like that very much. <laughs> These flowers definitely say King of the Jungle to me, or at least jealous uncle of the King of the Jungle. Why don't I bring the Scar the flowers, and he can be a little hmm. grumpy. Um, okay, but tell him that they're from someone who wants to make him smile. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll meet you on the bridge near the Sunlit Plateau after. Where is Scar? Where is he gonna be? Is he... Talk is this talk to Olaf? Just talk to Olaf again? Uh, okay. I mean, I can give do his daily task anyway. Uh, make sure that way. Bring this flowers to Scar on Olaf's behalf. Okay, where is Scar? Is he up here? No, oh, he's right there by the bridge. Nice. That's convenient. Can I, get, can I walk through that way? No, I can walk through Goofy's yard though. Scar, where are you? I just saw you. Please still be there. There he is. They have a nasty habit of walking away when I've seen where they are. I need you. Oi, 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 oi. Do you want to give these? Ooh, yes. Hello. I've got a gift for you. Okay. A raggedy bunch of flowers. Surely you weren't fool enough to gather these for me yourself. They're from Olaf. He really wants to make you smile. Pass on my appreciation for these pedestrian posies. And then tell that cloying little snow sculpture that if he presses me again, I'll turn him into slush. Ta-ta. Ta-ta. Aww. Aww. Hey, thank you for the follow. Thank you so much. Welcome on in. Um... Where is he? By the bridge on the Sonic Plateau. Okay, up here. He couldn't just meet me here by these stairs where, like, literally he's down the bottom and then I'm here. That would be nice. No. Over the bridge. Where is he? Olaf? Olaf, are you here? This is the bridge he's talking about, right? Oh, here he is. Aha. Mm hmm. Hey, look is it no not you maui not you not you olaf there he is talk to me oh good you're here i love it this guy like his bouquet uh, do i oh what do i say to him i don't want to upset him but also i can't lie to him i don't think so but they were so beautiful wow it really is tough to make some people happy i just wanted to bring joy to the whole village Something's happening. I think everything we did together is making a new memory appear. <gasps> Hands down. Pick it up. Let's see. What is it? <gasps> oh. Oh, he put on like a little play. Mother Gothel and Eric and Scrooge. And Mickey and Merlin are there. Do we're gonna have to build this, aren't we? This is giving me flashbacks to when we played my time at Porsche. No, not Porsche. Sandrock. And we had to build the stage again. That was a pain. Because that took so many resources to build. Okay. So, talk to you. Hello. <laughs> Can you still laugh? That's why I miss you for the village. Stories before the forgetting. I was the official village storyteller. That's how I brought the joy to the village. Oh, has anybody else seen those little shorts of Olaf on Disney Plus where he does like quick um, rundowns of Disney movies? They're so good. It's like meant to be taken from when in Frozen 2 when he does like a quick rundown of the first movie so people can catch up to where they are. It's like that. They're so good, aren't they, Ninja? <laughs> like, I was like, I'm not going to like these. They're going to be just rubbishy little Disney shorts. But I watched them and they're really good. Welcome. Thanks. To Jurassic Park. <laughs> Thank you so much for that raid. What are you doing? Thank you so much. Oh, my goodness. 
thank you for coming in if you don't know tinks you'll love tinks honestly it plays a lot of disney Janet valley if you don't know me hi my name's jen i use she her pronouns we're playing some of the new update today but before i get into it we have an update a uh, raid video to show you have a look at this raid video See can you repair the tv <laughs> she's in labor and the tv is on fire right go 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 all right concentrate 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 It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I meant to do that. Oh, question for chat. Has anybody who plays Stardew Valley? <gasps> hang on, 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 yes! <laughs> I've played it for an hour and I've killed something already. Oh, <laughs> Just put your hands in something. Oh, 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 um. Excuse me, where is she keeping that vacuum? Friends is not straight, but then again, <laughs> neither am I. Hi, thank you for coming in. Thank you, thank you. And see, if you guys who are in chat before the raid, if you don't know Tinksy, you must go follow them right now. If you like Disney Journal Valley and you like decorating in Journal Valley, the inspiration I got from watching one of their streams loved it it's so good how are you finding the new update things thank you so much for the follows thank you thank you Neri went hi i know you hey they're one of the best raid videos you've ever seen <laughs> thank you um my friend Gigi berry did it for me from some um for some clips so yeah i love it she did a great job she did an amazing job um i'm liking it so far i know you now you get scared i recognize your name from somewhere and everywhere and i can't remember where from but i have seen it in a chat somewhere we've been somewhere at the same time somewhere together before and i can't remember where from <laughs> you know you recognize my name now i can't remember where from but i i have seen your name before welcome on in everybody so yeah like i said my name is jen i use she her pronouns we normally play a lot of stardew valley on um stream but obviously brand new update for Disney Night Valley. Had to check it out. So if I come over to move the screen. We have, when the game comes back, game, game. There we are. We've just got Olaf and Mirabel. I didn't play it yesterday at all. Because I end stream at like two, my time. And the update came out at two, my time. So I didn't have time to play it yesterday. So this is all brand new. I'm liking it so far. It looks good. We've got Mirabelle, like I said, although she's still in her house, not done anything yet because I need to get a bunch of stuff for her, like the wood and all that. I've just done a quest for Olaf, the whole like getting the salmon and the flowers for, for people. It's so nice. I'm, I love it. I miss this game. I forgot how much I missed it, to be honest. I haven't played it since like Christmas, as you can tell from my outfit. I'm still in my Christmas outfit. And, um, one thing i will say controversial it may be i'm not enjoying the microtransactions i knew they were going to come i knew they were going to be there but still it does not lessen the sting of seeing them in a game i mean i knew it we knew they were going to happen because it's a free-to-play game eventually it will be eventually but still <laughs> like we were working out how much real life money you'd have to spend to get enough moonstone to buy all of the the stuff that's in the store it's it's gonna be it's a lot it's a lot it's like 45 quid every five days or something no thank you even ea doesn't rinse you that much money mm. sorry game love but when you're more greedy than ea you got problems you don't like that they gave them to us this early yes like at the moment it's still a paying game it's not a free to play game yet so i don't think they should have bought them in this early <laughs> and, and there isn't a stage in frosted heights it must have been destroyed during the forgetting oh no we've got to build that haven't we Ugh, we'll build a new stage it'll be even better than the old one i'm sure uh, i can even remember how we build the old stage we use some softwood on iron ingots and rope great um, now I wonder where the curtain though. Oh no, not more cotton. Um, I know someone who could help us with that. Minnie, she's great with all sorts of creative things. Nice. Yeah. Uh, okay, also, before I get into it and forget to say, if you need to raid and run, please do. Please take care of yourselves. Um, and that goes to anybody who came in with the raid as well. If you need to head on out because you've been watching Tingsy for a while, 
then um, yeah please take care of yourselves go grab a drink get away from the screen all those lovely things i'll be here for like another half an hour or so you were just typing that yeah i'll be here for about another half an hour and then i'm back again on thursday next week so i will see you when i see you if you need to go but yeah take care of yourselves oh it's just had to rain did oh. you know that rain has just melted snow oh he's talking about the rain <gasps> oh okay okay so we need to get i have softwood and iron i need to get some rope and talk to minnie to get the curtain however i'd like to get mirabelle i think i think that's gonna be not not that one not that one i think i want to get mirabelle before i go further with olaf because i need her to be out of her house vinius hi what do you call a scottish shark that's lost their marbles a loon shark <laughs> oh dear me vinius get to bed vinius it's bedtime for you. Shh. 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 Be told. <laughs> right. Softwood, stone, yellow daisies, dandelion, and green rising penestamins. Where can I get all that stuff from? Do I have it? I'm like, knocking about at home? Maybe. Maybe. In my chests and stuff? Shall we go have a look? I'm sure I do. I'm sure I have at least some of this stuff knocking about. Um, Let's see. Oh, I love the new... um. The days when I stream, I do normally stream Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. Although this coming week, I'm taking Tuesday off because um, it's half term for my kids, which means they have a week off and we're going out on Tuesday. So I won't be able to stream this Tuesday. But yeah, normally Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. I also have like a bunch of my socials as well. So if ever any of my normal days or times change, I normally post it in Discord or on Twitter. So yeah, come follow me and all those places. I appreciate it. <laughs> Let's go and see my room. I'm looking forward to the chest updates in this and the ability to like label chests with signposts. That's pretty good. Um, you don't um have much streaming in the morning for you, so it's nice to find some new ones. Yay! Oh, thank you, Nuru, and thank you. Yeah, I stream from 10.30 a.m. UK time until about 2 uk time because i like i said i have kids so i have to go and get them from school so i stream while they're at school in the day that's mom life for you you know right let's see we've got two daisies two dandelions so can i split the ooh, split these we'll take two out put them back and then we'll transfer that take no 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 um, no, <laughs> if I can remember how to play. Split two of those out, put those back. And then what did I need? Stone and soft wood. Oh, did I just take two out? I needed three. Ignore me. I needed another one, didn't I? Transfer. Um, split three of those. There we go. And green rising penestamins. They should be in this chest right here. This one. That's these. And how many of those did I need? Hey, Tori, hi. Hey, the new storage options. They look good. I've got to say, I haven't played it for a long time. So I'm still kind of remembering what I was doing and where I've left off. I'm not a decorator. Not like Tinksy. Not at all. So it's like a big mess everywhere. But it's, it's fine. We can't all be amazingly talented like Tinksy. But softwood and stone let me grab a i'll grab a whole stack of that actually and a whole stack of that as well bring the materials to mirabelle in her house okay we'll go do that i like that there's different size chests now that we can have big ones i wish there was a way to like upgrade the chests that you've currently got rather than having to make all brand new ones you know what i mean but um it's fine i'm happy with it where is Mirabelle? She's at her home, which is over here. Everybody who's already got Mirabelle, where did you put Casita? I was struggling thinking where to put her, but we decided that the plateau was a good place. You only just like how expensive the new ones are. I haven't even looked at the materials, but I know that I couldn't make one. I know that when I went into the crafting menu, I could make the mediums, but not the larges. So I guess that they had a lot of stuff in them. Look at this house. It's so pretty. You got it in the corner of the meadow where Merlin's house was before. Oh, that's a nice place to put it. Like, I wanted it somewhere that was kind of reminiscent of Columbia. Because, obviously, that's where it's supposed to be, isn't it? Hi. Um, give all these. 
I understand why inside is only her nursery room, but I was kind of hoping that there'd be, like, it would be the big kitchen area. You know, where the dining table is and where it's Hi. open to the world and stuff. I think it makes sense because how much can you can store in them. Mm. Uh, is it, how big is the storage in the larger ones? Is it like the full stack, like a, a bigger one? I haven't even looked at it. You found Aww. everything. Thank you. Your timing's perfect. I know just how I want it all to look. Let me give you a hand. It'll go faster if we work together. <laughs> it gives you a use for the dark yeah. wood and the gold. Oh, oh, it's the full chest. Oh, is it really? Oh, that makes sense then. Yeah, 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 yeah. 48 spots that is good also hi melon how you doing melindre the large one is all unlocked yeah that does make sense then because then rather than having the two rows you've got like all of them you know this reminds me of when people in our encanto came together to help my family rebuild casita it's much more um to all of us ah huh. it really means a lot to me that you're offering to help if you're ready let's do this let's do this <gasps> Look how pretty it is Whoa. inside now. Me encanta. It's so much better. Muchas gracias. I couldn't have done it without you. Me encanta means I love it, by the way, in case you don't speak Spanish. Um, which is why I want you to have this. Oh, is that is that a wallpaper? Is that a floor? That's a floor. It's this floor. The floor tiles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can use them in your house if you want to. <gasps> yes, please. Yes, please. You wish the dark wood was easier to collect. It barely spawns. Mm-hmm. Yeah, thank God it gets pretty out, right? <laughs> it looks so much nicer now. Look at that rug. I want that rug. That's nice. Um, so glad we can fix up Mindy Casita. Caring for your house is an important part of turning it into a home, don't you think? Absolutely. I should put on even more love into my house. I bet you'll be really happy if you do. And just so you know, I'd love to help. Have they upped the spawn rate of the dark wood? Oh, have they? Oh, that's good because that one's the hardest one to find, isn't it? The dark wood. So you've got the softwood and hardwood aren't too bad. The, is it the dry wood, the white one? That's not too bad as well, up in the frosted area. The dark wood's hard to find. Like maybe five pieces a day or something. Um, It's only in the Forgotten Lands, yeah, yeah. Scrooge McDuck, it might have what I need. If it doesn't, you can always place an order. I've heard it's pretty easy. I I've never like done that, you know. I've never, apart from when you do it in the tutorial part, I've never placed an order for a furniture. Ooh, ooh. Oh, I have a message. I will get back to that in a second. Um, purchase furniture from the, the school to do your house. Nice. It was five pieces at a time, but now you think it's seven. It actually was five. I was just guessing. Was it actually five? I but there, so seven's, I mean, it's only two more, but like two more over the course of a few days adds up to like a whole extra day, right? I don't know why I'm walking. I could just zoom. I could just fast travel. What am I doing? What am I doing? The wells are there for a reason, Jen. Use them. And uh, let's go in here. Quick max. Yeah, it does. How you doing, villain? Oh, what is that song? Two plus two is four, minus one is three. Quick maths. Oh god, it's so bad. Hey, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Thank you. It spawns more than once a day as well. Oh, does it really? Oh, that's good to know. 30 minutes to an hour. Oh, well, that's good then. So you get a few. Is that like an eye? Is that a monster's ink table? Greetings, <laughs> I kind of, I kind of weirdly like it. <laughs> Did it know they upped it? Yeah, that'll be good. Just going to hoard all of the time. Make one whole large chest just full of it. How's Disney Gym like going? It's going well, thank you. Yeah, this is the first time I've touched this game, even even off stream for probably like oh, months. Since before Christmas, I reckon. Bye -bye so now. I'm checking out the new update and I'm enjoying it. So I can purchase some furniture. What's the cheapest piece of furniture that I can buy? Because I don't want to spend a lot of money. I quite like this um this i quite like this this planter let me buy that does that count if i just buy one thing does that count yeah it does nice. now what do i do decorate your own casita change the wallpaper change the floor add the furniture to your house hey let's go do that oh to bed no worries simon no worries man's not hot yeah man's not hot <laughs> take off your coat man's not hot oh god that song 
Dear me. That's dragged up some kind of memory that I thought I'd forgotten all about, villain. My lord. Have a good weekend, Simon. Thank you for hanging out anyway. Thank you so very much. Right, shall we decorate in my bedroom? Look at my mermaid bedroom, by the way. I don't think I'd shown you a lot. Ah, it was villainy, but then I got the mermaid wallpaper. So it's got some villain pieces still left in it. But look at that wallpaper. It's so pretty. Oh, thank you. <laughs> like, I haven't put much effort into it. The living room is mostly like the Buzz Lightyear stuff from the... um. Oh, when I when you got the game and you got like the extra furniture with it, that's mostly this. And then I've got just a storage room at the back, which is just boring storage room. I'm quite proud of my kitchen, I have to say. Considering I'm someone who doesn't normally decorate in games. I'm quite I'm quite look at that. I'm quite proud of my kitchen and dining area. <laughs> Scrap pop pop. Oh my god, villain, no. <laughs> Why? Oh yeah, I still have the Christmas dining table out as well. It's fine. It's fine. So yeah, I come in here for my kitchen. And I'm like, can I help you? So pretty. See, I try and decorate it like I would decorate in The Sims. Because, like, I play... I haven't played The Sims in a while. But I do play The Sims a lot. and Or used to. And I play a lot of Stardew Valley and stuff. So I thought I'd decorate it as if I would, would do it in The Sims. And that this is how I would do it. So yeah, change the wallpaper. I could change the wallpaper in here. I like the floor though. Saying that, I've got that new floor, haven't I? She gave me some new floor. Can I put the new floor in here? Uh, F. Um, ooh. Where's the um? Hmm. Oh, the outer space. Oh no, no, this one. This one. I love that. Okay, okay, okay. That. This wallpaper here is so nice i'm gonna it's not going to be very space themed in here anymore but i'm okay with that i'm okay with that that's fine um cancel that then and then can i do a floor i love it it's like a it's a tangled one in it if we could get some sims mods in dreamy valley oh, can you i wonder if they're gonna be able to make it mod mod friendly you know that would be nice. I know that in Coral Island, when they were doing the Kickstarter for Coral Island, one of the, the stretch goals was to make it so that it would be mod friendly in the future. That's not available just yet because it's still early access, but we did hit that stretch goal when it was on the Kickstarter. So fingers crossed in the future, we're going to get mods for Coral Island. Are Disney going to allow us to mod this game though? Like I feel like some games are okay with mods, Disney are very protective of their IP. Very protective, as I have come to know. But that's another story. Um, but I don't feel that they would allow mods in it. I don't think that they would allow the, the API to be accessible. All right, let me put that... Ooh. Um, you want to move objects so bad? Yeah, I want the... Um, I want the, like a chest anywhere kind of mod for this one so I can be out on the beach and haven't got to run all the way back to my house to get something out of a chest. That's what I would like, please. <laughs> That's the kind of thing I'm after. Right, can I put... Where did that... Ooh. Hang on a second. Can I put the Gaston's chair in here? It does not match at all. But um, it's just a piece of furniture, isn't it, that she wanted? So that's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Hi, Lewis. Lewis, you got gifted a sub earlier. Merlin dropped a five gift sub bomb and you got caught up in it. So congratulations. Did you ever mod The Sims 1 or 2? No. No, I did not. I did not. I didn't start modding The Sims until Sims 4. I was always really scared that I was going to break my game. And also, um, just a little bit of background history. I didn't actually have internet in my home until i had sims 4 so i couldn't even download the mods to get them if i wanted to so yeah <laughs> that's fun when i was playing sims 3 sims 3 came out the year my son was born so i didn't have much time to play it anyway and we didn't have the internet at home then because you know we were young and poor so no internet for us so no mods on sims 3 so I didn't get any of the Sims 3 store stuff and I didn't get any of the Sims 3 
DLCs that were in internet only, like download only. I only got the ones that were in like physical copies that you could buy a disc of. So yeah, that's me. You broke your game 95% of the time. Sims 1 naked mod was the worst. Oh my god, can you imagine? Even in that one though, in Sims 1. I can just see in Sims 1. <laughs> Oh, I need to just add five pieces of furniture to my house. Oh, ignore me, ignore me. I was thinking it was just the one. We'll add some more, don't worry. Um, What can I add? It's not giving me very much pieces of furniture to add. I don't have very much pieces of furniture. Oh, look at the lamp with the cowboy hat on it. No, stop. I'm gonna, I wanna put that somewhere. Where can I put that? Can I, can, can I, I can't put that anywhere. I can't, it doesn't fit. I'm gonna just put it down here then instead on the floor it's fine sully's chair none of these are actually gonna fit in for now but i'm just putting them in so i can finish the quest <gasps> look at the table is that massive it's slightly big but it's not too bad this is a seat this is a seat oh okay well that can go down there then and was that one two three four that's the five that's the five pieces isn't it that's the five yay there we go and then we need to return to mirabelle there we go. I remember that hearing that installing mods in the older Sims games was a lot harder. I mean, at least now it's literally just drag it, drop it in your mods folder. Much easier. Is Mirabelle still in her house? She is. Oh, but her image appears now, which is good. You don't know about getting to sit that low. <laughs> so clever. Yeah. Your knees. Like, I'm short though, villain. So to me, that's fine. I'm only five foot two. We're good. I'm fine. Okay. Let's go and find Mirabelle. I'd like for her to come out of her house at some point. I love how when you walk towards the casita, it like greets you. I love that little image. That is so good. They could have not done that. They could have just left it as a normal house, but no. They added that and that so is glad you're here. brilliant. The footrest. Oh, and the little Ursula thing. Yeah, I think I'd probably treat it more like a little uh, buffet for your feet. Hola, Jenny. I love when they add the Spanish in. They also add the upside down exclamation mark. So it's proper Spanish, not just the Spanish word. Can I help with anything? Just inviting you to see what I've done with my place. <gasps> really? Yeah. Did I? I can't wait to see. Let's go. Let's go. Vamanos. Oh, oh, oh. Um, are you going to take me to your house? Follow Mirabelle back to my house. I have to follow her. Come on, let's go. Yeah, not just English is spelled Spanish. Exactly. They haven't just written hola with an H. No, it's hola with an upside down exclamation mark. Love it. There we go. Come on, follow you down. I could have just zoomed here much quicker, Mirabelle. I could have zoomed here. You kind of remind me of my sister, Luisa. Go inside your casita. My casita. Me casita. Here we go. Do you like it? Do you like it? It's so good to see you. Amazing! This house shows that you don't always need actual magic to make magic happen. I love this wallpaper. I'm going to keep it, but I need to re-decorate and get rid of all the Buzz Lightyear stuff because it does not fit at all. Both our houses are looking so much better. I'd say it's pretty impressive. Mm. And now that Mini Casita is fixed, I really want to make myself useful by helping the other villagers because that's what La Familia Madrigal is all about. Helping the community. Oh! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> You're allowed to say that, villain. It's fine. <laughs> oh god, what, what? Wait, what? Oh uh, dear. Automod was like, no, you're not allowed to say that, how dare. It's fine. I can't read it out loud because my son is home from school, but I can read it. I'll be your eyes and ears around here and let you know if anyone needs help. See you soon, Jenny, and thanks again for your help with Vini Casita. You really you're welcome. You. Mm -hmm. That kind of thing, yeah. You're gonna be lurking for the last 10 minutes. No worries, I might call it early, actually. I think I might just go and talk to Minnie. Because I'm feeling, I've got a bit of a cold, you can probably hear it in my voice. I've got a bit of a cold come in and um, I'm getting a bit fatigued. Like I need to go and have a drink and a rest. Oh, here's Minnie. Minnie, 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 Minnie. So I might just talk to Minnie and then call it, I think. 
Uh, no, 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 no. Minnie, Minnie, Minnie. Whoa, she just disappeared then. Why, hello, Jenny. It's so nice to see you today. Is there something I can help you with? Do you have any curtains you can spare? It's probably so weird. What a weird question. A stage? Oh, how exciting. I know. I can't wait to... Help with his plays? Star in his plays and dazzle everyone with my incredible acting. Oh, I can't wait to see that. And you know what? It's your lucky day. I just picked up some new curtains from Uncle Scrooge and I have a little extra fabric. Aw, thanks, Minning. Hey, and then we need some rope. Can I make some rope while we're, like, here? I probably don't have enough fibre? Question mark? Rope? I need eight fibre. Can I make eight fibre? Oh, I can. I can make ten. Hey. And then I need some... How much rope did I need? I've forgotten. Four. Four rope. I wish it told you so I didn't have to keep coming out and remember it. I can't remember things. Don't want to try and get me to remember things because I can't. Oh, no, no, no. That was eight each. That was eight each. You know, I've been bothered by the copy paste aspects of this game. The fact that it's Disney makes it all lovely. Yeah. I need some more of this. So I need, like, I need loads. Can I make, uh, I'll make 40. I don't need the seaweed for anything else. I'm not going to make any sushi or anything and i can make another three of those there's me four Sunshine. craft the stage right, everyone, let's enjoy ourselves a drink. is it under furniture it is <gasps> but i need softwood i only have 13 and i need 18 oh softwood's the easy one to find though isn't it softwood's just the one that's just about the place like this uh yeah yeah one two three um four and five there we go that should be enough let's go craft this stage i have no idea where i'm gonna put the stage i'm gonna guess he wants it up in the frosted heights because he said that's where it used to be um stage make there we go sorted and then where do you want it bring the stage to olaf where is olaf uh you're up here the forest of valor where is he? Um, and the house. I always get lost up here. I'm like, um, which way is the house? It's over here. If I ever actually pick it up and move it and decorate it and put it in a place that I want it to be, I know for a fact I'll forget where it is and I'll keep going to where it used to be. That's why I haven't moved any of the houses or anything. Or done much decorating at all, to be honest. Wow. Why are they always here? You. Why are they always in the wall? Every time I come and see we'll them, they're like, soon. wall. Okay. Uh, give oh do i not have to place it is he gonna place it oh hi oh hi very impressive craftsmanship Danny. but let's not put the stage up until we're ready to start the show huh? now that we have to place to tell stories we just need to find some stories to tell don't worry journal valley is full of stories that we'll find something thrilling and action-packed <gasps> oh manager i see it already i'll do some pondering about this and let you know when i'm ready to begin okay cool that one's complete nice so, oh. how are we with our new quests and stuff? We've done them all. Hey, Sammy, hi. What was the update? It was a new big update, actually. We've got um, Olaf and Mirabelle from Encanto. Uh, and um, there's a lot of quality of life updates and stuff. There's so much. I don't have the the thing with me right now. Don't even thank you so much for that follow. I don't have the blog post with me right now. But on their Twitter you can find a link through to it and it's like a list of everything that's new plus all the bug fixes and improvements there's a lot there's a lot um so yeah make sure you update your game if you haven't there is a new event yeah the new event is a disney 100 centenary one a centennial star path i haven't actually been through and looked at the rewards you know should i have a quick look through the different pages so i've got these um oh there's a little oswald that's a nice little outfit and they've got the light um there's a chair is that a bracelet another piece of art some shoes a bed okay a mini outfit that statue's nice um a mickey outfit a little steamboat willy thing i like that that's fun and then your last one at the end so yeah and then you got your duties and everything to do as normal 
and you've got 40 days to do it i feel like last time when it was like 53 days or something it was just too long so now they've brought it down to 40 again you have to play yeah do you play on on pc or on mac or on switch or whatever it was 50 days last time it was wasn't it It was a bit longer i prefer on being a little shorter because i'm probably going to end up completing it in the first two weeks let's be honest you want it on switch do you find it difficult to decorate on switch because i know people who've got it on switch and on pc and they like the switch aspect because they can play it in bed or on the sofa but when it comes to decorating they kind of play it on their pc because like it's really tricky with the controls and stuff i don't have it on switch i only have one copy of it yeah um, i know people have been lucky enough to get two copies and but then like you can link them via the cloud save but then obviously you gotta buy two copies of it which is a pain but yeah i know you already just come in and you already just followed <laughs> um but i am gonna call the stream now it's a little before two i normally stream until two um but yeah i am gonna call it let's uh save there i'll come back and i'm probably gonna continue to play this a little bit more off stream let's quit that quit that and come over here a reminder that i'm not streaming on tuesday for those of you who are new in hi by the way my name is jen she her pronouns blah, blah, blah. um i normally stream on tuesday thursday friday but i am taking this coming tuesday off because my kids are off school and we're going out somewhere for the day so yay family time is trump's streaming time i'm sorry but it does i'll be back here again on thursday um thursday and friday next week we'll probably be playing some more um stardew valley which is more my main game really than this but we'll see we'll see i might hop into dreamlight valley in the beginning do my dailies and then hop into stardew we'll see but i am doing a marry everyone challenge over in stardew so if that sounds like your cup of tea i've been putting the vods up on youtube so those links there there right there the socials come follow me over on um twitter come subscribe to me over on youtube um catch up on all those parts over there over the weekend and i hope i'll see you again next week but we're gonna find someone to raid and um for those of you who know me and know who is live currently i think you'll know who we're gonna go and raid mm, the divorce everyone is a challenge it really is divorcing everyone in stardew valley is the challenge because divorce is fifty thousand gold each and there's 12 of them which is six hundred thousand. <sighs> so yeah we're gonna go and raid my wonderful best friend um gigi berry formerly known as Bruz momo she's playing some sims 4 right now she's speed running the 100 baby challenge and she's up to 82 babies and she reckons she's going to finish it this week so great we're going to go give her some love and support she's also the one who made my raid video for those of you who came in with tinksy's raid so we're going to go and give her some love as always she's one of my favorite people in the entire world i love her with my whole butt let's start that raid okay i will see you next week have a great one I'll be on socials in between. So come and say hi over on Twitter. Like I said, come and say hi YouTube. Come join the Discord. And I will see you next week. Bye.